Hello? Hello? Chat? Is this... Is this the internet? Is this the internet? Is there an internet here? Does anyone know? This is not? Oh, damn. There's one internet here. There should be two internets here. You get it? Because there's like... There's Twitch and there's YouTube now. Which I'm slowly getting better at figuring out how to make that work. I have the wrong numbers here. Oh no! We're just watching Ted lose at backpack battles. And then we'll get started. What's an internet? I don't know. A mistake, really. Time to dig a hole indeed. Indeed. Let us launch the game. It's early for me, chat. My brain doesn't know how to be a, this person early. Yeah, those were words. It's 3 p.m. Well, fine. By some definitions of early, it's not early. But by my definition of early, it is. Been up since 7 30 and worked out well you know what Bree not all of us can be uh, can, not not all of us can be okay you know what Oh, does this work? Quick turn this on. It does work. Neat. Turning it back off though. I guess I should probably like 
Sweet. Then I'm going live. Should probably like actually use Twitter properly. Kitty's 18th birthday. Nice. My old lady kitty is sitting in her bed next to my feet. Taking a little nappy nap. She's only like 16 though. Still pretty old for a cat. Alright chat, quit. Just quit. That's too much violence, chat. That's too much violence. Stop it. Hello. How are you? I'm wet. Because I washed my hair. I'm wet and smell wet. <laughs> I have a lot of hair and when it's wet, it smells like wet hair. So that's how my day is going. I'm very moist, yes. Quite damp. Um, this this is my current I'm just waiting for Ted to finish losing at this video game Yo, hey, what's up Kyle how you doing bud Kyle we gotta get beers and pretzels or other snacks again soon Also, I'd like to, this reminds me, Twitch decided to throw a billion ads at you so you can't see shit, what the fuck? That's, that's some double bullshit because I literally manually run ads, well not manually, I run ads on a timer so that pre-roll ads don't play, so if you got a bunch of ads, that's Twitch sucking the balls. Thanks, Twitch. Yo, Bree, gifting that sub to Kyle. Thank you so much, Bree. Appreciate it. Wow, that's 445 gifted subs from Bree. Goddamn. Planning on going to BlizzCon. I'm not going to be at the actual convention itself, but I will be like in the area hanging out at like the hotels and stuff. My plan is basically just to Uber over, drink in the Hilton lobby, and otherwise just hang out. So I will be around. I'll probably like watch the virtual ticket on my phone or something and then just hang out after. Yeah, yeah, those were the those were the good old days in a sense. Oh, 
Apparently all the streams for this kind of free this year. Yeah, I've, I felt like it's been that way for a couple years now, but I don't, I don't remember exactly. Uh, so today, chat, we're going to hit up some more uh, Moria with Ted as soon as he's finished losing in this weird backpack game that he's been playing. Um, <laughs> I don't understand this game. But yeah, we're going to do some more Moria. Um, later tonight, we will either do more Atlas or depending on what people are up to we might jump over and check out the new arc because i did get a code for arc survival ascended i'm not like i'm not the biggest arc fan these days but who knows it could still be fun might check it out see how we feel nordheim's starting up a arc server so might have a peek at it. We shall see. Want to see the new arc, but I'm grumpy about their comms. Like we didn't even know their prices until like today. Yeah, they've been, they've really been studio wildcarding <laughs> everything with this, this release. Like, I don't think we even knew that there was, it was releasing today until today. At least I didn't. Thoughts on Moria Beyond It's Fun? Um, so it's got a ton of potential. There's a few like quality of life things I would like to see them fix up a bit. Some of it is just the interface is a little janky in a few spots, which is not like, none of it's like game breaking or anything, but there's things like, like if you look in a chest, for example, uh, you can't just close the chest. You have to, if you press escape, it takes you out to the main menu or not the main menu, but it takes you out to the menu screen. Um, if you press tab, which it says close inventory, press tab. If you press tab, then it opens your inventory. So you'd have to press tab again. So there's like basically two key presses to get out of any um, inventory, which is just weird. Uh, it feels unintended and hopefully they fix it. Um, there's a few like mechanics that are a bit odd, um, and thus far, like the base building feels very, very muted. Like you kind of just, you build a base where, um, it kind of tells you to essentially, um, hi Jarkson. Um, but yeah, you kind of build a base where it more or less tells you to in Moria, uh, which is fine. It's not my preferred, I, like I prefer being able to go, I really like this spot. I'm going to build a base here. But since so much of the game seems to be like digging deeper and deeper and deeper, it kind of means that you end up making a new base every so often. What I'm hoping, um, just last night, um, Ted and I unlocked the ability to make our own fast travel points. So what I'm hoping is that we can just kind of decide like either here's a really cool spot that we really like, or, um, like we just decide one of these little outposts that we've been building is the main base now. So we can just be like, right, we'll use this for everything. And then just the other spots are just for like quick storage or whatever. I don't know. That's what I'm hoping at the very least. It's also possible that the two like little outposts that we've gotten so far are like early shit. And now that we can make fast travel points, they'll stop giving us those. And we have to uh, um, make our own base from here on. I don't know yet. Got to play it some more to find out. But I've been enjoying Moria. Um, it's a lot. Honestly, it's a lot better than I expected it to be. So definitely lots of fun to be have. If you liked Valheim, you'll probably really like Moria. Might pick it up if it's got depth. It does seem to have some decent depth to it. Not least because you keep digging lower and lower and lower. 
<laughs> yeah, I got my key. Ted got me a key, so I actually don't even know how how much it is. Um, on the store, let's look. The sick hat, thank you. I really like this hat. It is $40. I do feel $40 is a little steep for it, but there are some people who that will absolutely be worth. It's also only on Epic right now. Um, it's planned to come to Steam later, but... I know some people, like, I don't, I don't care if games are on Epic. I have no problem with the Epic store at all. Um, but I know some people get really, um, really antsy about the Epic store. But I've been really enjoying it. I would love for Ted to finish losing at this video game so that we can play it some more. Vendor competition is good. It is good. No, having, having basically Steam being the single only place to buy video games uh, is very problematic for the industry. So Epic existing is good. Um, yeah, he's... I don't know what this game even is. He just, he's been playing it a ton. Yeah, the friends list is not super good in Epic right now, but for the most part, like you get a game, you play the game and it's fine. Also, like, I don't think people really realize a lot of games like Moria probably would not exist if not for the Epic Store. Um, just because Epic pays so much more money than Steam, uh, which allows studios that otherwise would not be able to afford to even make a game to begin with to actually be able to do it. Like. A lot of people don't super realize like being an indie developer especially it's it's fucking hard. Getting funding to like pay your people can be a huge challenge. So the fact that Epic pays out significantly more than Steam and Steam has just been sitting there being like, no, nah, it's fine. We'll just, we're the big ones. So we'll just continue to pay peanuts. Crazy concept, getting paid to produce things. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, there's been a lot of good free games on like oftentimes when I'm just bored, I like I end up claiming the free games on um, Epic pretty much all the time. So sometimes if I'm just bored or I'm like, yeah, I don't really feel like playing any of my normal shit today. What else is around? I'll end up scrolling through either my free games on Epic or um, uh, stuff on Game Pass.
I do think Epic really needs to add like modding support properly in a hurry though. Like they've been supposedly working on that for ages and it's just still not around. thing and me getting my game pass for free as long as I offer it as a point of redemption. Nice. What is that? Microsoft Rewards? Never heard of that. We're still just waiting for <laughs> Ted who I told like fucking hold on let's see. Uh, I said I'm good whenever an hour ago didn't hear anything from him so then half an hour after that I said I'm firing up stream now uh, and I did say no rush which was probably my mistake because I think Ted's idea of no rush is I'll just play another three rounds of this game <laughs> We'll get there eventually. Can I edit the message? <laughs> it's too late. He already saw it. Convince him that he read it wrong, even though it says edited next to it. <laughs> yeah, that'll work. <laughs> Just say firing up stream rush. <laughs> it's the craziest thing, by the way, today, chat. Uh, fucking, it's not deathly hot outside. In fact, it's not even like 70 degrees outside today. Yeah, it's currently 69 degrees outside. I need to... I don't know, it does... I need to fix where that zooms in on. So I have like half the windows in the house open and turned the AC off so we can get some fresh air in, which I may regret because there's a tree right outside my window that makes my fucking allergies go insane. He's still, he's still just doing this. So we're still just waiting, waiting for Ted. Chad, if I type a message in Twitch, tell me, tell me what message I should send in Ted's Twitch chat. What should I tell him? Hurry the fuck up. No, I know what I'm going to say. Are you going to play Cities Skylines <laughs> today? <laughs> hey man, I think you misread my message. I said rush. <laughs>
Uh, he like genuinely answered my question. That's a little disappointing. All right, here's what we're gonna do. While we continue to wait, we're gonna pause the music. We're gonna judge. I don't know anything about this game. So we're just gonna judge Ted playing this game. By the time he's ready, my hair will be dry. It's true. This one did both scythe and sword. Backseat oh, game in the whole time. Yeah, exactly. I mean, he keeps pointing his daggers to the left, but I know the enemies show up on the right, so that doesn't seem very smart. Now he's pointing them down. Okay. Also, I don't know what all of this stuff being in his backpack. Get a bit of a move on here. Like, how does this stuff in his backpack uh, actually let him fight? Does he just throw his backpack at people? Yeah, fuck that thing. He feed it to the mimic. Although we do hate John. I'm torn. I'm gonna find your hotel room and shit in your pillowcase. <laughs> Don't think he knows he can leave half run. I think he knows. I think he just doesn't want to. There's so much like weird bag Tetris that I do not understand. Cool man, look at that though. That's pretty. I don't know if we're gonna live to actually take full advantage of that though, from uh, the perspective of. of um, like I get that you have to move stuff around, but sometimes pretty nice. Maybe it's like things that are next to other things is what matters. I don't understand this game. Oh yeah, we, we don't like those there. We gotta put those back someplace else. Cardinal sin, not having all the daggers under there. Yeah, we gotta have all those daggers under there. That one dagger is not gonna get the boost. Well, well, yeah, this is this was the conundrum, right? The yellow stars get bonuses when things that work together Dagger sit together. Every 3.5 seconds, guaranteed applies two stacks, double the stacks of poison under the scythe, or attacks 35% faster which is I don't think I want to play this game <laughs> so I don't think I want to play this at all it's better than next to this sword for sure plus it already has 10% here for sure okay there we go uh, well, I'm just gonna put this back here though this is only the demo too isn't hitting site. Yeah, I know. I, I don't know how to get it on there. All right. Without, uh, now they're fighting. It towards the site, and it would hit only the site instead of the dagger and the sword. It's tough to say. There's going to be standing. It's true. He is choosing this over me. Swinging. He apparently won. I don't even know where we can put it. I mean, if we could get scythe and one dagger, sure. Rotating it like this just hits dagger. Rotating it like that hits dagger and sword. All right, we're gonna change. We're gonna change our Twitch title to "Judging Ted while we wait for Moria." In fact, this should actually probably be down here. Now it hits three. A 
of the room for you. Nice. There's a book. There. Oh, it's a bag. <coughs> Sloot oh. waiting room. Yes. It's gonna be a book. It's a bag space, right? I wonder if we can make it to a full hour. It's been 45 minutes since I told him I was starting upstream. 50 minutes, actually. Yeah. No, 45 minutes. Math. Another 15 minutes of this, and it'll be an hour since I told him I was starting upstream. Dagger can go below longsword, below longsword, but then it's not going to benefit from the scythe. If we put it here. Or here. Yeah, when I... So, you know, Mini, when I typed hi in chat, it was because he wasn't paying attention to the DM that I had sent him 15 minutes before that. <laughs> Maybe that's the plan, Jarson. I start this game, I get real good at it, and then I beat Ted so that he loses and then we can play Moria. Put the blade here, it's out of reach of the sword. If we put it here, it's only going to buff a dagger. Oh, yeah, you got to make sure that it's buffing the dagger. If we put it here, it's going to buff just the scythe instead of two daggers and the blade. Yeah, you wouldn't want that, whatever that means. I don't know, I think it's as good as it's going to get. Maybe there's something else, but I don't want to spend too long thinking about it right now. So Josh is waiting. Yeah. Gracious. <laughs> <laughs> used to watch the weekly marmot and game breaker as well glad you got on with blizzard hearing you in the wild videos is pretty nostalgic keep up the good stuff well thanks a lot muscle memory appreciate it i haven't been at blizzard for a couple of years now but you know just still still going at it still working in games and stuff doing cool shit but yeah i appreciate that muscle memory Or bananas a weapon? Yeah, apparently. Oh, he's gonna die. He died. That was a battle of the ages, Eddie. But he's apparently still going. Got a gem to get, Red. Survive two rounds. We gotta win two in a row. <laughs> He has lives like a cat. Oh, <laughs> <He's> not... <laughs> no, no, we're not even going to entertain that, that idea. We can get two, three, four. How much is this? Six. It's only nine. We'd need three more. What are we? What's going on here? Uh, yeah, it's off the stones of the mushroom. Oh, yeah, good call. Good call. Um, yeah, put some gloves in a random spot in your bag. Bible. Specific. Oh, that's a waste on the side. Don't eat it, bro. Should I have a little one? Oh, we got a little one slaughter. How about that? Oh, I got a piece so bad. Oh, it's coming out in every direction. <laughs> oh, <I don't laughs> streams after right houses and bullshit streams up on a different monitor. Fair. This certainly is entertaining. While we're just waiting, waiting on Ted. Oh, we just gotta go. Hope we win. Hope we win. Oh, it's my transition. I didn't do. Let's oh, hope he doesn't win. Bitch. He seems to be winning. 
He seems to be winning a lot. Ooh. <laughs> like no mana jump. What the hell? Or is he immune? Watching Daisy all over again with Backpack Simulator. It's uh, funny. Did that Which means... Get rid of this. Put this here. Put that there. Oh. God. Now he's moving a ton of things around. Just boot up the game. That's that's what's sitting in the background right now. We're just waiting. But also the game isn't on Steam. <coughs> Can't believe we didn't get a big shield this time. This is the last round, right? So we're just gonna go. Fire's banana. B A N A N A N. There's a pineapple. Take the pineapple and shove it up your ass, Ted. Two more. Sell this. Oh, good. He's selling all his items. Actually, I should have kept that mushroom. Oh, well. Let's, let's play. All right. Operation. Shove this somewhere. I kind of hate. Right, press the wrong button. Oh, bladder. <laughs> I kind of hate that I'm genuinely starting to see how this game works from watching this. Did I ever get a garlic in this game? Yes, we're waiting on Ted to fail so we can play Moria. All right, that's it. Our final hurrah. Apparently, this is it. The final hurrah. <laughs> He's just fucking like sitting there trying not to piss in his fucking chair. <laughs> Alright, I'll be right back then. We are switching over to um Oh god, I can't I can't even stand up straight. Or I gotta pee. <laughs> was worth it for observing <laughs> excuse me observing that holy shit holy shit that's very funny all right well hopefully he'll be back <clears throat> sometime this week pull him up on my other monitor now so that i can know when he's back around <coughs> fuck I wonder if I can, like... Like, make... Play the same character in my own world or something? <clears throat> I don't actually know how the multiple worlds work in this. Alright. So if I create world... Play offline. So do I still have my same shit? Like, I assume not. <clears throat> Alright, 
No, I do still have my same shit. Wants me to craft a torch. I'll craft a torch. Just whatever is on you that carries between worlds, not recipes. There must be a way back to camp. up. Kaali Rukinas. Are you from our camp? Ah, and the winds. Ah, I am Eric, son of Eric. Yours. Kind of didn't realize we could have been doing this the whole time instead of watching Ted. What's happened <clears throat> to the rest of camp? I wonder how the same way out for any other survivors. The start is like how much of this is like procedurally generated. Like this all seems very much the same. But I would assume, like, this is basic Hello? tutorial shit. Hello? Is this where we gather for dwarves to have female voices? I don't... <clears throat> uh, are you playing City Skylines today? No, I said not. Are we not playing? <laughs> I'm just fucking oh, trolling. Oh, I see the meme from yesterday. Yes. I did appreciate how urgently you had to pee and how that was basically the only reason that you actually stopped playing backpack game. No, I said it's rude to keep Josh waiting. And we should probably go. <laughs> there was some further optimization that could have made to my bag. Alright. world. <clears throat> <laughs> so I'm sorting my back. Launchers permanently loading. Oh. I think that's how you want it. <clears throat> you prefer it when games don't ever actually launch. That's the way you like it, baby. Launching. We good. I've sent you a squad invite. <clears throat> Hmm. We'll consider it. <clears throat> Fuck. That fucking laughing so hard I started coughing now fucked up my throat. <laughs> One of these days, chat, I'll go to a doctor <clears throat> and learn why I've had a cough for like eight years. <clears throat> One of these days, I'll go bankrupt. Yeah, exactly. That's what I said. Should we give her At your service? Uh, 
mountain smiles on us today. Does our doom always? Oh, if only my Nana could see this. All right, perfect. <clears throat> I require the code. Oh, you sent it to me. Okay. Yeah, it just did. Yeah, yeah, totally before you asked. <clears throat> uh, what were we in the middle of doing? You were looking for 10, right? Uh, I think we were just... We had just finished getting the um, fast travel shit set up. And we were just kind of exploring the area for different resources. I don't remember. I think there's some, like, boots that we could maybe craft. Uh, <clears throat> not yet. We need more statues. Ah, uh, yeah. Exploration it is. <clears throat> Ugh. Wait, hang on. Oh, right. What, what do we need for that new hammer? Oh, right. The... You mean the pick? Yeah, the pick. We need... Uba Sam Wood. <clears throat> Was that like a POE boss? I, I don't know. We got orcs. They're fighting the spooters. <clears throat> I think there was purple shit up over here. Apparently, this is just going to glow. I have a glowing, permanently glowing spear. <clears throat> There's a statue over there. And here we'll bring a curse. that <clears throat> glowing ceiling shit Are you in the base? Uh, I'm exploring one of the side paths nearby the base. Okay. Don't step in Ivan ooze. Woo. Oh shit, what's that up there? Oh, that's coal. Right? Yeah. <clears throat> this 
here is more iron. We just marked an iron, so I don't feel the need to. Mark I one. Monsters in the air. The bats are doing well today. somehow get that statue without getting fucked. The horde seems to spawn around where we are. I wonder if we even have to run back to the base now. Because it's not an attack on the strongholds anymore, right? It's just a horde spawn. Yeah. Oh, speaking of horde, looks like it's almost time. Are you at the base? No, I'm rebuilding a statue. Nice. Oh. I discovered the purple shit. You can um, just make uh, platforms over top of it. Ah. Are you go back to the base. Are you making your stand where you are? Uh, I, I might, assume they're going to go back to the base. Anymore. I might just have to do it here because right, cool. I'm like on the other side of a bunch of purple shit. Um. Okay. Actually, I've killed them off, so I think I can come across. My character is weary, so I'm going to have to head back, I think. Yeah, I'm on my way. Up, please. I have returned to base. <clears throat> I hear them, but I do not see them. There is about 700 of them chasing me. Oh, perfect. Uh, also, I find some arrows. They're in my head. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet. Thanks for bringing those by. are stuck because they can't come through the holes that we mined out they're too small but like they're like legit all spawned rows they usually like dig down and then come oh, back true, out yeah. oh that's right i put the orc bane enchant on my spear which is probably why it's glowing uh
That was weird. Oh, neat. My dude decided to block in the wrong direction again. I found <clears> that <throat> the problem with that is that it'll respond to your WSAD over your mouse prio. It will, like, it doesn't 90% of the time, and then it just randomly will for no apparent reason. Yeah, but, I, but what I'm saying is that's what it is, so just don't trust the mouse whole yeah. direction. I've had it randomly decide to attack in different directions than what I'm facing several times in this horde also. The shield dash is super OP, by the way. Yeah, it's or like good. any, yeah. Just lets you get full combo off. I'm tired and cold, according to my calculations. Do you wanna? Do you wanna cuddle? I don't see two bunk beds, sweetie. <laughs> Some dude stalking outside. Let's put the shit away and then I should be ready to rest. Oh, I guess we should put some cooking on. Made two skewers or making two skewers. I'm going to repair all my shit before we rest too. Another black diamond. Nice. Did not even see it. me in the corner okay don't forget to eat okay I think there was a setting for Oh, let's do that. That's good. Hold the sprint. Yeah, there we go. I just found an option to lock the mini map to north and that's excellent. Yeah. I like them spinning, I don't know, I'm just more used to it from WoW. Uh, I've always had mine locked to north in WoW too. So I think I didn't, I don't know.
<coughs> is that copper? Literally taking damage from despair. It says find light. I'm standing in a light patch with a torch. It's not doing anything. It's needed. Is it because you have that shadow curse? I guess, yeah. I didn't touch the poop on the ground, though. Okay, now it went away. What resources are we really looking for right now? I think we needed some tin for bronze. And really just those okay. trees, I guess. Yeah, I think I'm I'm mostly just exploring right now, looking for trees and just marking everything else that I find. Which I just found another copper deposit. Yeah, I've seen a few of those too. Side of that iron deposit. Mm. Found bite weed. Found bite me? Yes. Bite weed. Uh, the best of all weeds. I appear to have found an orc stronghold. I don't like so strong. We got orcs. There's so many orcs here. Right.
the plan. Oh, gonna shoot at me if they come back here. Never mind. Oh shit. Um. I just found a uh, journal okay. page in a chest, and it said find the nearby journal to put the pages in and see what the fuck's after. Yeah, we found a few journal pages. Oh, really? I was more surprised I said what the fuck in their description. But... Also this. slowly wake up we make a bunch of that We make one of these. Uh, shit. We are at high danger level, by the way, and all of my shit is very far away. Also, very far away. Do not have time to wait for all that to cook. I need to go get my shit. Should just be right up here. I oh, found the way to go. All right. Actually, you might be able to make your way over here and you can put a hold here, it looks like. It's like a bottleneck door. I do want to take on this orc stronghold at some point. It's not far. It's an orc stronghold? Long. Yeah. That's no. why I've been fighting this whole time. That's what I said. <laughs> oh, sorry. I literally had you muted. What's up? <laughs> but yeah, there's like a big fucking orc battalion that I was slowly whittling down. Saint Orc Italian? Battalion, oh. for sure. Like, hey, hey, the dwarves are coming, huh? <laughs> hey, I'm walking here. <laughs> oh, there's a house here for you, too? Good. Good. I assume you mean, like, a fucking... Tiny okay. pit or something. There's a cage in a car. <laughs> Even better. 
you know exactly what I like. Back to high danger. Okay, so basically, I got here, and the, there's another cursed door, and he's like, yeah, you can't go here, bitch. You have to go really down. Now we have to find the Crystal Descent, which is, I assume, our base is in that pit. Search for the massive mineshaft leading to the lower deeps, it says. Yeah, I remember finding a spot at one point that went lower. Mm -hmm. uh, which means I'm going to start heading back to our area. I'm going to go back to this orc. Fucking thing, and then I'll come help you with the orc thing. Oh god. Drums in the deep. They're coming. I should probably not be fighting a horde and this. Oh god, they're all on me. <laughs> I have no idea where you are, but I'm coming back towards our base. I am running towards our base very quickly. Mm, you know what? Maybe I'll relax here for a bit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. First guy I killed dropped a black diamond. Hello, I'm here.
Jesus. I just got fucking dumpstered. <laughs> fucking hell. Yeah, you get buffs for admiring treasure. Jesus Christ. Why don't I pick up iron ingots? Jesus. They broke our door. Are they inside? Yeah. Oh. Well, the good news is there's even more spawning, so it's hard to get back. Oh, they're finished. Okay, they'll just leave now. within the base. There's still an orc here. He shoved me into a corner and molested me. And now he's leaving. Well, the good news is I've come along with 15 other enemies, including bats. Jesus. Uh, are you okay? Yeah, I've just been repeatedly dying in the base. Okay, you, my weapon broke and you hit that guy in the head. He's nice. gone. entertaining I made some food if you need some uh, more than likely I do thank you shit out here to loot BT dubs Really? Well, repair my sh uh, shield. Well, they're in the base. I just wanted to host a dinner party.
All right. Are the hordes coming now? Oh, good. And because this is very well implemented, I now have to pick up these fucking pallets. Okay, just that one. What was that? Oh, you can put pallets on walls? Yeah, somebody in chat just said that. God bless. Oh, fucking yes. Excellent. I'm going to reorganize shit then. Holy hell. Three black diamonds from that nest. house one sec i was trying to move them slightly slower so or slightly lower so that they could be more easily accessed but that did not fully work It might just be the wood pallets that are the problem. Kind of depends on the product. Yeah, because the... I just the, put an iron one, look how low it is, because it doesn't stack very high. Yeah. Strong Heldon. Hmm? Do you want to go to the stronghold and fuck him up? Uh, yeah, just a minute. Where is it? I'll just start instead of sitting here staring at you. Actually, actually, while you're doing that, I'll go feed the cats. Alright. Maybe.
<coughs> Excuse me. Can I not build this on top of that? Okay, well, that, that works enough. A little step up. Almost works. Only you could build stairs. This is a very silly game. Oh. <laughs> so you can overlap them if you have one halfway empty.
chest is permanently stuck there. I wish I could make like signs or change the names of these or something so that we can organize this shit a bit better. This one, take this out. Actually, let's make this the gems one. random collectibles too. And this one, let's take all of this shit out. We'll reorganize all of this. Yeah, I didn't make sure about that. Not a problem. I'm organizing these boxes. Ah, well. It's a losing battle, but... So which way was that uh, stronghold? Uh, it is out and to the left. Noted.
Oh, the grass is purple crap. Uh, you can jump along the wall to the side. Oh, I see. I don't know if I went to the right place. I'm just looking around. Yep. If you went across the purple crap, then you're basically on the right path. I did not. I'm in Orc Town. Uh, Which is a, apparently a place we're supposed to check, by the way. Yeah, you're at the Orc stronghold I was talking about. Oh, it is one? Okay. Bite weed. Oh, I got that yesterday. Oh, I got that earlier today. Yeah, that was where I got it from. so many of them so many orcs in orc town Defeated the orcs of Orc Town. No, they're still me. Ah! 
bunch of various. Ooh, hold on. There's two black diamonds in that. Oh, here too. I just got it in the other chest. Nice. Well, you got two, and I got two. That means we have seventeen of them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's that's how that math works. So they don't pay me in math. They pay me in meth. Like above, wait, what's up here? We're like above the forge that we used to be at. Below, you mean? I don't know if above or below. Uh, maybe below. Gems. It's even more orc town this way. Thank you. We don't have the uh, horde alert thing. Yeah, this is. Yeah. If we kill them, they won't spawn here anymore. If we kill them all, though, I'm really going to miss this. It's breaching. <laughs> don't worry. If you need a good. <laughs> oh. Stop it now. I think that's gold next to us. It is tin. On the other side, I meant. Oh, oh yeah. Precious gems. You mark those yeah, I'll mark them if you didn't. Uh, I did not, yeah. Hum diddy, if you lose your way and your torch goes black, hum diddy, oh dayo, you can whistle clear and they'll guide you back. Hum diddy, oh dayo, hum diddy, oh do. And once you know how the diddy goes, hum diddy, oh do, means at the open door with the rain. You can sing for your supper and a good night's rest. Hum de de o de o, hum de de o do. Again. Wait, there was a word before that. Oh, never again. <laughs> Oh, more gems. Spears durability ain't long for this world. Yeah, mine's getting a bit rough too. It's up there. More gems. Did you try getting in here? Yeah, we could break through it. It'll just take forever. Oh, I see. I don't really like I mean, like this. 
Yeah. Munch in there. Let's we... climb over too. Current opinion on the Detroit Lions? Uh, they certainly are a sports team. I don't really follow sports. Especially not the Lions. Again, hooray. Oh, that is a boss. Oh. Maybe we come back to this. You want some Mario? Did you say Mario or Moria? It says Mario is ours. And he went, ah, 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 and twiddled his mustache. Uh, I'm at we half... tried poking him a couple times. Yeah, I'm at half your ability on my spear. Oh, These I'm guys like are a quarter. Bullgack. Fucking ballsack. Well, there he is. He is damaging everything around us in here. Uh, archer guy on the far side. I can. I can. Oh god! If you can keep his attention, I can stick on the little ones. Is what I was trying to say. I, uh... Yeah, no, turn now. But that spawn behind us? Like a lot. Oh shit. You will fall. Trying to keep clean those up. My spear is just like fucked though. Yeah, I had to dip back a bit because I'm hurting. Uh we should go like I'm I'm just literally gonna be useless soon. I have perished. I am still trying to not perish. Uh, where are you at? In bed. Oh. Still chasing me. I gotta get back to my bags over there. They're leading them out. This is gonna be. I'm trying to see if I can thin out the pack that's on me. but I think it's in there somewhere. Yeah. Long ago. Probably just gonna have to run for it. There's just more of them spawning, so you probably just gotta fucking sprint for it. That's it. There's a little icon. The boss reset? 
I don't know. These, I don't see him anymore. The bar's gone. So I, I don't see so. him or his bar, but these guys keep spawning. Oh, I got my shit back, but again, That's all you've got. my spear is almost duds. Yeah, let's let's try and just leave Orc Town. All right. Remember the sprint jumping thing? I think they have stopped chasing us. Oh, good. No one's back at the base. Mm. Oh, I, hate this. I bravely ran very fast. Yeah, I'm right here. This dried fruit is really good, by the way. It heals for like health? yeah, it feels like heals like half of your health form. Should probably carry some of that with me. Yeah, I just started cooking a bunch of it. Um, I'm also tired. We can start up a couple of nice meals and then sleep. Yeah. Oh, let me empty bags first. All right. I tried to semi-organize things. So mm -hmm. if you like food stuff and both of the ones on the left are food stuff and then the other stuff okay. is kind of everywhere else. They immediately need to add a fucking... Deposit all like things. Yes. Yeah. All like items, yeah. That's one more for me. What a good change they can make for the game is uh, if somebody's in a chest, you shouldn't be able to go in it either, just so it wastes your time. Yeah, that'd be a, that'd be really great. I would, I hope they implement that immediately. Never. <laughs> Our food be done. Probably rest soon if we're gonna do it. Yeah. Ready? Yep. Although, do we need to rest? I guess so. I was tired. Like, I had no stamina left. A few good food, isn't that? Wow. 
four minutes. Some on the ground behind you. Okay. I assume it doesn't go bad. Nope. All right. Well, we'll get get gabbing or get going. Oh, one second. I just found more shit in my bag. I discovered while you were AFK earlier with the uh, pallets, if they're not full, you can still, like if you empty out halfway a uh, wood pallet, for example, you can then build one above it on the wall and they'll just like oh, no, overlap. No. Oh, nice. So they can just kind of like spam deposit between two of them. Yeah. Sounds terrible. I hate it. Yeah, it's a bit weird. All the bitter shit spawned again. Now let's all grab. Yeah, I don't know what it's for yet. Looks like if you bite it, you'll get really high. This is the place. And they're still spawning and attacking us, so. I'll guard the rear, I guess. Dude is back to full health. Most of them are just kind of chilling watching. Yeah.
Trying to hold the horde back. Hey, ball sack died. Oh, the other guys leave? Nice. You drop. Eight black diamonds. Holy shit. Damn. You know what else this game needs? A hold E to pick up everything near you button. I was just thinking that was all spam. Wait, that's all I dropped? Like nothing special? Uh, let me look. Eight black diamonds, nine iron ore, two sapphires, eight steel ingots, eight hide is all the shit that I've picked up. I don't know how much of that came from him versus something else. That's the axe fragment. Find the second axe fragment, and there's these chests. I'm up to 11 X or uh, black diamonds now. Nice. Some to which one's this precious gem? This looks like gems here too. More gems here. I'm not going to bother marking all of them in this room. It's a pretty big open room. So apparently we searched the area for the axe fragment. We didn't actually find it yet. We just have to search. No, I think I see it though. It's up here. <laughs> I can't get down. I'll just go ahead and take this while you do whatever the fuck you're doing up there. Oh, the uh, third axe fragment's up here, too. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's it here, yeah? Yeah. That's cool. I, I, like, I was worried that there weren't like any bosses in this game, but... No, it was it was neat. It was, I I don't like that it like spawns a million enemies, but then they all just stand there watching you. Like that's just weird to me. Why spawn that many enemies if they're just gonna stand around waiting to attack until I've finished fighting the three enemies that are already on me? Yeah, I mean I get it. I mean it makes sense they can't physically attack it. There's no space, but. Yeah, I, I just find then it. Why spawn fifty of them? Yeah, it's exactly. Like three harder ones, yeah. So I guess we gotta go down now. I have become weary again from that. You what? What? What did you say? I have become weary again from that. Oh. Uh, so yeah, we can like just go cook go. the food in the base. Yeah. Gotta go back there. Gotta repair my shit. Unless we got infinite amounts of precious gems now when we need them. Yeah. We got so many black diamonds now. We can basically make any um, True. fast travel we want. We could probably go up and put one in that fucking thing you forge you wanted uh the only reason to go back to the forge is to make that super shield uh That's which true. i screenshotted yesterday so i can see we could probably make the mats and go do a round of it real quick and then yeah i mean if we're there i might as well plop one down and then just pour it back we're a little on tin though like it's really hard to find tin yeah 
Yeah, I haven't seen a lot of tin around. I keep making jokes like my tinny tin tin, and it's useless because I can't find any. Mm. Um, I did make a. Oh, we could probably actually get across this. Did you? I was gonna say, did you go across that way yet? Not this way. You having a laugh, mate. That's a lot of coal. What was this? These rocks, uh, looks like iron or copper. a surprise puddle there. It's safe. <laughs> Bunch of stat two statues. Ooh. One foot seven. I don't have any stone on it. I have a little bit, but not much. We need eight more here. for this one. of this one. Uh, this one needs five. Steel sword. Have we tried mining that crystal shit in the ceiling? I don't know if you've seen that stuff yet, but it's all I've over. seen it. I didn't know. Uh, ooh, roasted parsnips. Did we get a parsnip somewhere? Yeah, there's like a little thing here. I accidentally destroyed the bed, the bed it was on, though, so it's the only parsnip we'll ever get. Need one more stone for this. We can probably just hit there's a wall. There's a ton here. Plus a copper up in. We got orcs. They're being attacked by the dumbest orcs ever because they're dying in their own shit. Both of them already? That's all you've got. Yeah, I got both. Oh, I see. I see. The second one was some new gloves. It started on it. We've managed to get halfway complete on like 12 things. Yeah. Now. I have noticed this. Oof, this place. What is this? Silver? But we can't mine it. Ton of copper here. Oh, I found 
found a big machine. Oh, this is the crystal descent where we're supposed oh, to go. Nice. Holy fuck. Rebuild the mine hoist. We need three black diamonds. No, we need 15 black diamonds for this. I have 11 on me. I have three. <laughs> uh, 20 elven wood and 30 natural fiber. Oh, there's a fast travel here we can build, at least. And it doesn't cost oh, nice. blackstone. God bless. Root quartz. Hmm. Make a new torch. Wonder if it's a torch that doesn't burn out. Yeah. Or maybe it's just brighter. That'd be nice. Yeah. Is there anything over here? Oh shit! There's a wall. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm gonna port back to the base real quick. And yeah. repair my armor and we grab the treadmill. The rest of what we need to repair this. So. Yar. Uh, there was still a way, like just in, in the room right before this one, like across the purple shit. Okay, I'll go look. I haven't, uh, I didn't build a bridge though. This is getting pretty cool. I think the deeper you go in this game, it's starting to yeah. build cooler environments and stuff. I don't see anything across the purple shit in here. No. Nor the VPN. Mm, I hate this. I did get insta cursed from accidentally stepping in the purple shit. Only overreactions allowed. This is the most amazing dwarf simulator I've ever played in my life. No, I really like it. It's really good. Um, it needs some work, but... Sorry, with the black diamond there. It's very fun. I have been enjoying thoroughly. We haven't built a bronze uh, bar thing yet, have we? the um thing to let you smelt bronze yeah we have oh but I, we don't have a pallet if that's a pallet i meant yeah yeah i'll be back one second and get the thing hey Because it's Lord of the Rings. Yeah, it's no, I'm I'm having a lot of fun with it. Um There's definitely a lot of things I would like to see them improve. But there's a ton of potential for sure.
want to see if I can find that new recipe we just learned for that new torch. I'm done for trolling. It's time to eat. Eat. I'm back. All right. I don't see the recipe for that torch in here. Uh, could be some special forge we have to go to. Yeah. Oh, there's a such a thing as a Kuzdul forge, which is something else apparently. I say it's down in that shithole. It might be. So if you go and you look at the recipe list, you can click the Kuzdul Forge. That's where I see the like special shields and that tool. So it might be that that's something that we need to take up to the other place. Where is this? So um, easiest way I've found to get to it is let's like look in the forge and then click recipe list. I just go first here. Yeah. Quiz Dual Forge. I think the one that we saw up there, though, that, was that the is great... that one. It is that one. There was also oh. the Great Forge of Narvi, though, which it might have been that instead. And that one uh, does also show the show that torch, though, so we might yeah. be able to go up there and get it. Yeah. Well, it seems we have to do a run there anyways to set some fast travel down. Yeah. We will need. Steel, true quartz, wood scraps, and hide, which we have plenty of. Uh, you didn't bring the, uh, build the bronze pallet, did you? Uh, not yet. I was okay. getting the remaining parts. Now I will build it. Mm. Oh, I hate this. There is now a bronze pellet. Oh, I'm starving. I put things on. Can we put one more? There are now three of them cooking. Uh... Enjoy the interview on the starting zone. Thank you. And yeah, the Tolkien estate isn't doing creative direction on any of this shit. They're just saying, yep, that's fine. We'll license Lord of the Rings to you and allow you to make a game. Look at my torch. What does it look like to you? Well, it definitely looks like you are reverse smoking it. You have it like stuffed in your face. Mm. Oh, I hate this. The weary. Be worth a sleeperoo. Yeah, maybe we make one more of these and then do a sleep. Hey, while you do that, I'm gonna run to the forge and build a thing. Oh, I can't make just one more of these. What the fuck? Are you able to make one more of these? I see. It's saying meal, meal table needs cleaning. Well, there's Even, still food there, that's why. Yeah, it, it, it's weird that we can't make another of the same thing that's already there. You really find it that weird in this game? Fair. 
It's the thing. Map stone. Yeah. So it's going to take three black diamond, 20 stone. How much? Did you fill your black diamonds away? Yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, 26 of them are good. Yeah. Uh, I ate one more of those, and now I'm not weary anymore. Oh, I mean, I could eat one more, too. I just I'll, ate it it I'll, just, I'll just get it when I work back. All right. You're just going to go fix the thing real quick. Where are you heading? To the old forge. Oh, okay. That middle base we had so that I could put a thing down. Warp. Right, there's like 700 zombies or uh, dudes outside our base. Yeah, I'm fighting them. Yeah, no, that, that's that's just not how licensing works. So basically, they will say to someone, like, if you want to make a Lord of the Rings game. We went down into this pit, did we? No, we didn't. That's a, I thought that's where we'd have to go for the main quest, but... Yeah, that's what I was expecting, too. Basically... Worth a visit. Maybe the trees were down there the whole time or something. Might be, yeah. Basically, if you want to make a Lord of the Rings game... Then you go to the Tolkien estate and you say, hello, Tolkien estate. I would like to make a Lord of the Rings game. And then they'll be like, okay, what's the game? And you like give them the pitch and they decide if that's something they're interested in or not. And if so, then they'll say, all right, we'll license to you for X amount. You, you pay us X amount of money and we will let you use our license, our, um, our brand essentially to make a video game. Um, they might have some stipulations on like overall quality of the video game where they say if it's not, like if it's seen as damaging to our brand, then blah, 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 whatever. But they're not gonna be like, all right, and we're going to have regular check-in calls to make sure that the video game is the video game that we wanted because they don't, at that point. They are, they are the IP owner. They are not the creative direction for the game. Oh, they, so they didn't even do that oh, anymore. No. Fair. So for video games, it's Middle Earth Enterprises, and they're the ones that do the shit that I just said. To build a fucking hearth for this, oh, I didn't take the mats. Oh, yeah, fair. If we build a hearth, that also means it can get attacked. I don't know how useful that is. Well. We can build it up top where they can't jump to. True. And come all the fucking way here. <laughs> but I mean, what you're saying is true. It's not like they like they haven't attacked our original base. That's true. Yeah. You have to, we have to be in that area. So if we pour it over and they attack, we're yeah. already here anyways. Have to find some random coal somewhere, hopefully. I don't know if I'm going to find any coal here.
Interesting. It's also showing like explore like your old base area. I don't know if you see that too. Like an axe. I do not. That torch is apparently a masterwork, which means if we have that, we don't have anything else. Oh, is it? Oh, because you can only have one masterwork item? Yeah, that's what it's. Well, one, one like. of the shields we can craft is masterwork. We don't yeah. need to make that shield, but. What's that? It depends what we want. It just depends what we want. Yeah. Is it expensive to make the torch? Like, maybe we should make one, see how good it is. Uh, no, it's not. 15 true quartz, which we have 49 of it now. Uh, a steel ingot. Four wood scraps, one hide. I'll grab the parts and come up. And do you need coal or something up there? I already moved away from there. But yeah, I mean, yes. I mean, we need to make a hearth, and then, then I have the mats for the portal itself. I'm basically in the original area now, looking around to see if I can find some coal. If you're coming up, then I'll basically wait for you. Yeah, I can just bring up some coal if that's all you need. To run back, anyways, I suppose. Water to steel, true quartz, wood scraps. Oh, we're under siege here now. Where you are? Yeah. Wait, which base? I don't know which one that is. The Mines of Moria. Ah, okay. Yes. Uh, thank you. The, the... Is that our main base? Yes. Okay. <laughs> uh, I can actually almost port back, so. But I'm very tired. That's the problem. Uh, I might be fine. You need me to come back or no? I'm in the base. I can port if you need. Uh, I'm probably fine. If it's up to you. Nah, let's go build the stuff. I got the coal from this base, so. Okay. Now I can, you can just port when you.
kind of want to make this place bigger. Could pretty easily expand it out a bit more, like out to this. Wait, was there a fast travel in the house near this thing before? I can't remember. That we could have just repaired. There was, I think. Okay, I'll go check. I'll go check real quick before I build the wrong one. Yeah. That maybe there might not have been actually. I don't remember now. Like... On my way. was not. Whole public domain thing depends on jurisdiction. I think it also depends a bit on like if they've granted the license, like if the estate grants the license to someone, I don't, and then it's still being used. Then I don't think public domain really becomes a thing. But I could be wrong. I hate Josh, this found a map stone, which I built literally myself in front of me. What? All right, that's what I was going to uh, in, in the chat, it says, I hate Josh, has found a map stone because I built it oh. interactive. <laughs> oh, fuck. That means I'm going to have to run up there myself anyway because I have to find it to. Do you? Try, try working. Oh, no, there it is. Elven quarter. Shouldn't have said anything. Damn. <laughs> Uh, let me see here. Okay, so there's... So of the two shields yesterday, we had a, a Region shield. Is our shield tier one or tier two? The tier two. The Heirloom shield is tier two already, yeah. I don't... I don't... Like, I don't know that a shield upgrade really does anything, because it's already, as long as you hold right-click, you don't take damage. It might block more damage later, and if not, maybe it has more durability. Like, for instance, there's the shield called Shield Wall, which was the Masterwork shield, but it's also Tier 2. There must be a reason to make that, or... I teleported up here, but grabbed the wrong shit.
They don't think we should build one. Build one what? They didn't think we should make shields then? Uh, I mean, we can. I wanted. I was going to make one of the um, torches, torches oh. first just to see what that's like. Yeah, true. I do need to eat. I very much need to do that as well. One dance that I do. I guess we could like, we might as well make one of the shields and just see if for some reason it's better. Like, I don't, I don't know how it would be, yeah, but. All right, food's here. They're grabbing a shield too? No. Because you can... Oh, your masterwork is a completely separate slot. Uh, okay. It's a, a zero slot. It's the one way over on the right of oh, your I see. action bar. Okay, this torch is actually kind of sick though. Why is that? Back. Uh, because it just when you're not using it, it sits on your bag, in the back, and still ah. glows like this. Oh, that was pretty badass. I saw that other hat we can make too. Though don't forget, yeah. cobalt hat. Uh, well, I mean, I'm gonna go make a shield. I might as well just see. Yeah, just see what it's like.
looks like any other shield. Just cool looking. I don't know. I mean, it's, the shield sits on your back. I wonder if it blocks if somebody hits you. Maybe. Nope. Oh, well, hang on. Wait, no, hold up. That's weird. We should explore, before we go down the crystal place, we should explore the rest of that, um, like, down area here, because I bet we'll find some statues. Explore where, sorry? The, like, that section here where we could go down. Uh, that yeah. we never fully explored. Oh, like the big canyon? Uh Cabernet? Yeah. Oh God, gotta do this. I need sleep first, though. Get him. Yeah, I have no idea what this point of the shield is. Yeah, I don't know. Did you know there's a stats page? There is? Yeah. Open your inventory in the bottom left, there's stats. Click it, opens up like an entire panel. Oh well. Movement speed, everything. Apparently there's a luck stat too. Interesting. Uh, why do I gotta do this? We got orcs! Finish this one off!
Hell yeah. Oh shit, dude. Yeah, I'm just sitting here. I, I have no idea what the fuck this shield does. Chat and I are just looking around and nothing is adding up. Okay. I'll use it for now, I guess. We'll see. Maybe we'll discover something in combat. Sorry, you went down the hole? I didn't go down. Uh, I went like around to the side. I actually couldn't find like a normal path down. I think I just have to build a mass elevator or stairs. Yeah. But I went around to the side and I'm still finding shit anyway. Like I just found some more copper. That's where I found that um, statue. Hold over in a second. I gotta eat one more food. All you found is a bludgeon mall. It's also tier mm -hmm. two, though. Oh, I found ten. Apparently this mall is very good against armored enemies. Interesting. So, uh, are you max armor right now, since you rested? Or have you lost a bit? Max armor? Yeah. Uh, armor is based on whether or not it's repaired. Is it repaired? Like, are you full armor? No, I've taken... Actually, well, if, you, if you go to your stats... You have a second. Yeah, one second. What am I looking at my stats? 
in combat. There's max armor, armor protection effectiveness, crit chance. What, what do yours say? Max armor 135, protection 95, effectiveness 15, crit chance 0. Alright, same. Alright. Yeah, my armor. I have two broken pieces of armor. The only, the only thing I've noticed about this shield, but like wasn't a problem before, I just fought a bit with it, is it doesn't have durability. So you can just block forever. Yeah, I've but... never come close to breaking Yeah, this exactly. Thing. Finding shit tons of copper around here. Ah, another statue. Sick. Nice. New helmet. Oh, nice. Oh, I'm gonna go look at that right now. Yeah, you keep getting those all. I'll make sure the base is okay. Yeah. Steel and cloth. Tier 2 helm. Trapper hat's also a tier 2 helm, though. Actually, yeah, a I little think more the trapper hat it. keeps us warm. So I would assume that the other one is more armor or something. Oh god, there's so many statues here. Alright, we're about to get a bunch of shit. I'm repairing one, I see three more. There's the steel sword. Crafted one of the helms, so it seems to be literally the exact same stats. Interesting. I'm gonna put it away. There's some boots. We don't have any boots currently. At least I don't. I will guinea pig these for the horde. There's the battle axe. I mean, the thing, same thing with the... Oh, the Balox is two-handed. So no shield or, you know. Mm. The sword is a tier two. So it should be as strong as everything else. It's just a different attack type. It's slashing instead of piercing and shit. Yeah. So it seems that we have a slashing, a bludgeoning, and a piercing two-hander. Uh, tier two one-hander. And then that two-hander steel battle axe now. Which we can craft. Yeah. you see any animals on the way? We do need to hide. I haven't seen any animal. Uh, well, there's some rats here, but I don't think they give hide. All right, the, the legs were big gains. Almost an entire armor bar. So we have, we're still missing. We're still wearing tier one chest and gloves. Uh, yes. Gauntlets, we have one out of two. On, okay, I'm gonna come, start coming towards you. I found a fuck ton of copper in here, by the way. What did you know, you wee lad? And one tin deposit. Where did you go down? I did not go down. Oh, sorry, where'd you go then? Uh, when you get into the spot where you, like, looks like you can go down, I just went up to, along ah. the path to the left.
I might be about to finish that chest armor. Oh, I lost the base. Uh, no, I only got coin for that. I only got two coin for that. What the fuck? I well, don't really know where the hell he went, but... From your stream, it looks like you're going up to the previous base. Yeah, That's, is that not the way? That is not the way. Oh. Well, wh wh where did you go when you left the base? Um... So, like, if you look on the map, you can see where I am, and it's literally just that way. Um, so you go... Oh, I see, I see, okay. Yeah, yeah. Like this is all part of the same area. There's just that spot where it looks like you can go down and you might be able to go down. I just didn't go down. Have you tried mining these crystals yet? These big ass crystals? I have not. On the ceiling? I'm gonna try. Most fighters were dangerous. Nice. Chest armor. Looks like we're gonna need a bunch more hide to hold these pieces cross hide. That's not destructible stone.
We got orcs. I'm done for trolling. Time to eat. Eat. Patrolling! Time to eat! Eat! This does not go down far enough. Games I'm playing now. I'm playing. Uh, I do a lot of like role play stuff these days. Uh, obviously jamming on this today too, which has been super fun so far. How badly is Ted losing? I climbed that shaft in our base. Yeah, all the way up, and there's just like nothing here. <laughs> found a spot where we can definitely go down and there's stuff. I'm just trying to figure out the best way to get down there and also keep getting hit by cavens. Because those are apparently a thing.
the not mineable shit. <clears throat> oh god. Lagged off the edge. That was almost bad. Looks like the hordes of dudes stopped ever since we killed that boss. Could be, yeah. Nikki, <laughs> you're not helping. Pet the kitty. I just realized my like. Oh no, never mind. I'm done. Neato.
Yeah, the, I just made the chest. It's pretty, pretty poggers woggers. Nice. I'll have to come back and do all that at some point. This is this goes we'll on a lot. Though. Yeah, I'm going to start going towards you. Just got to eat. All right. I've not seen a single animal down here. So I killed a couple more, but probably. yeah. I think we could probably work to the forge area. There's usually some deer and bears there. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm hoping to find the fucking wood that we need down here, but... Ah, are you so the hope far. of England? I might be, yes. Josh Paul the second. About time. Hate them outsiders. Come in here. Taking our stuff. We'll take back what's ours. Kill them all. Get Inventory is coming full. I'd love to find a fast travel that I can repair. This is what here full. Uh, the room that you initially went to up to the left did you go to the right at all yet or no no nope. okay i'll check what's over there and then and in case you didn't know 
<laughs> I'm just hearing that constantly at the moment. Fucking orcs. I believe that noise is made by literally every fucking enemy. You went up the path, you said, yeah? Uh, yeah. Then okay. you should see a spot where I built a couple platforms to climb up. That's fine. I'm just gonna not explore in that direction. Oh, gotcha. That big room has, like, a way down. I found a Gandalf note being like, hey, you can go down here. Oh. the end of this particular path chat See anywhere else to go here. Mm, I hate this. Might finally be time to head back. Good, you can get hit by cavens while you're climbing a ladder. I did not go the way you said and still ended up here. Yeah. Did you end up as going? As far as you've gone? No, no, no. I've gone. So you come in here. I've gone Is all the... around this room. And then you can see there's a ladder that I built over there that goes down ah. also. Okay. I will go down. Oh, this is the starting room. Okay, good. Cool. Huh? Hey, this is the room where you initially went up to the left, you said. No. No, that was a while back. Wait, did you go down or up? I went you... up and down in here. So where I'm going now, you've been? Yes, I built that ladder that you're on. You can build ladders in this game? 
Yeah, you press F. Oh, shit. Was there any point in me going down here? So you've explored the bottom of this area? Uh, I've explored a lot of it. I think I've explored all of it, but I'm not. Got no point going down here, then? I mean, I'll have a look around, but... I've already done it. Yeah, there were a couple of like work camps down there that I. Right, I'm just gonna come back up. Who did all this? It's my time. Just go do the elevator now, I guess. You got all the statues you said you think? Uh I think so. I got coin from two of them. Ah, okay. Just where that would have the gloves complete then, but yeah. Well, so I got coin from one and then when I completed another statue, it still unlocked a thing, so I'm uh, really not sure. Oh, I'll just trust you. Excruciatingly discovered everything already. I do think there is a down section that we haven't gone down in. Where? That's what I'm trying to get back to to discover. But all of my shit's broke and I keep running into bad guys. I think this room that I'm in now, we can go down in. I think this is a different room. Is it the one closer to our base? Yeah. See, that's the one I was trying to go down. It's literally a carbon copy of the room I'm in now. I thought it was that room, and I can't find my way out of here now. Well, it's a little different. No, this is definitely a different room. I, I mean, I'll show you the stream. Like there's, uh, there's at least a section of that room that's like... The exact same. Yeah, there's definitely bits that look similar, but I'm pretty sure it's a different room. I have no idea how to get back to you. Lost as fuck. Did you go down that ladder? Hey, yeah, and then I came back up. Okay. Uh, I will get back to where I can repair my shit so that I can fucking move and not worry about dying. 
and then I'll come find you. more hide. I got back to that original room where I was going to go down. And you're like, let's go down. Ready to get down. Were you by any chance at the time uh, yelling timber? Uh, I was, but police came over and they said that I'd better move and dance while doing it. That's fair. It's also nighttime, as I remember. Surprised you do remember. I just found a cave drill. Oh. Did you go down in that other room? Yep. Seems to be two ways to go here. All right. Um, okay. I have a master work shield. He stands no chance. Okay. My shield doesn't matter at all. <laughs> it's <me> through it. <laughs>
I kill the draw. I've aged terribly during it. All right. For this statue. Hmm. A lot of tin down here, a lot of gold piles. see if I can get some uh, hide real quick so I can craft that armor. Yeah. Probably need a bunch anyways for the, the chest and stuff too. Or yeah. the gloves. Oh, a few tin of deposits down here as well. Yeah, there were a bunch that I found the other way too. I marked them. Normally there's tons of those things around here, but I'm not seeing any of them right now. It's a bear. I bet bears do. No, there's another bear. A bear nest! Doors have a treasure pile, yeah. There's a ton of 
elven wood just around. Bit odd. I was really hoping I could throw that. Oh, what the fuck? W sup. I just found a statue that we never rebuilt in the elf place. Yeah, I tore it down. I bet you did. Just to be a nuisance. Uh, do I have a tin or pallet? Yeah, we do. Treasure pile. Yeah. There's three treasure, uh, four treasure piles near the um, troll I killed. Just looted and brought them back. Just like a bunch of gems and shit. Yeah, and we nice. need a bunch of coin to be able to make uh, another one. But basically, those will store treasure, like pallets. Um, they store the gems and stuff. A bunch of coins. I mean, we have like 500. It, yeah, it takes like 700 to make one of those. I mean, unless you just got a bunch more coin, I wasn't able to make another treasure pile. I haven't tried. I'm just saying we have a lot of coins. Yeah. I don't actually find any of those goat things up here. No bears or anything? There's two bears that I killed, but I haven't found any of the goat things. I actually just saw one in the cave nearby. Interesting. I wonder if we, like, need to sleep because we haven't actually done that in ages. Mm, maybe. I have a feeling they kind of spawn just like goblin patrols. Yeah, maybe. I killed one goat. It dropped two hide. I've killed two bears, and I have four hide, but... That is all I'm finding. Oh, wait, no. No, those are wolves. Never mind.
Mm, nice. Really sure why there was a giant pile of wood scraps there. Not really sure why there's a giant pile of wood scraps here. Kinds of weapons in this game. So far, we found swords, war axes, battle axes, mauls, shields, and pikes. Definitely need those because I have no fucking boots currently. Gloves and chest. Low on hide for chest. I can make the gloves at least.
Uh, you learn skills, uh, same as in Valheim. When you first get a hold of materials, you will learn some things to make with that, with those materials. Uh, as far as I'm aware, there's no way to salvage old gear, no. I have certainly not come across anything along those lines. The second floor. It is possible, but like, there's no stairs, just rope ladders. So it's kind of annoying. Which I could put a rope ladder in. It wouldn't be that big of a problem.
back up there again and see if any more of them appear. The uh, deer things. Why this thinks that there's a path there? Another bear. A bear, bear nest. Ah, I need a better weapon for this. It seems like just the bears are respawning up here for some uh, reason. Once finished exploring this uh, down region, I think went like the last room. room for some reason randomly had like 10 hide on the ground. Hmm. Well, that's something.
<coughs> Excuse me. Let's see if we can make this. That. Where all the tin was, because we're only finding copper for a while. Hmm. Can I make the... I can make the chest armor. To make the chest armor, can I make the battle axe? I can. I can make both. Try the old battle axe. See what that's like. back to because I do think this hat helps with the cold and it seems to be the same amount of armor balance can stagger enemies and charging with left click will slash upwards Curious why that pile of wood scraps keeps appearing there. back at the base if you wanted to rest. Cool. Just put some meat stews on. Where are you going, you silly goose? Uh, I thought a loft Speech. might be. Speech! Nice. Speech! <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
Ready to sleep. Okie dokie. All right. But you have all the hide on you already? Uh, I used it to make the armor pieces. Ah. Oh, you made them all already? I made the legs and the chest and the gloves, yeah. <laughs> I made the... Yes, I made all of them. Yes. Okay. I never got a helmet for it, I guess. Oh, no, we did. We did, yeah. It, there's one it's in this box two, right over here. Now. Yeah. I was I trying it out for a minute, and I think... I still think that this hat that we're wearing makes us warmer. Sure. Not cold and alert in a while, so. Yeah, I was getting the cold alert because I was wearing the other hat for a bit. All right, I got full armor now. Nice. Getting any of the new weapons or nah? I made the battle spear. axe just to see what it's like. Oh, that's pretty cool. The rune? Yeah. I put the thunder rune on it also because we haven't. I haven't looked at runes yet. You should. The orc bane rune, at the very least, does more damage to orcs, so that's useful. I need to make another copper thing. Snips too. Fuck our face. Why the fuck did that happen? He's in leagues with the orcs. Get him. See, good as new. <laughs> <laughs> you know what that looks like to me? A World of Warcraft patch. <laughs> oh. 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 Said Terry. Oh good. Y'all not kill this dwarf. <laughs> oh goody. We got orcs. That's all you've got. He'll take zero damage when blocking with this. I'm not really sure. Well, the shield bash, I guess, but. Durability on the weapon, I suppose. Oh, 
I'll just charge over to attack a fucking... Said, Welcome to the Patch 10 Point Moria Survival Guide. I'm Josh Allen. <laughs> Welcome to the World of Moria Survival Guide. <laughs> mm. Oh, this does not have much durability at all on this axe. Oh, maybe it's the blocking. Uh, yeah. Maybe the blocking. Yeah, the blocking. I'm gonna put the uh drive away. I'll be right back before we set out. Hey. Going to uh, DOS elevator. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out why this fucking ladder I'm trying to build keeps falling apart. I mean, is it yelling timber? Oh. tired already. I'm starving. so much for the raid appreciate you maybe it needs support yo the audit queen with the five gifties <laughs> I'm going to sneeze. I'm allergic to, I'm allergic to that. Lux those for the 44 also. Thanks so much, everybody. Welcome, welcome. Quick Zotic. Got it. Oh, 
Ah, yes, very useful. Yes. Now this house surely won't crumble. Well, I've been trying to figure out why this fucking thing just falls apart. And that did not fix it. Brandy win with the 67 months and our song with the prime sub for four months also. Thanks everybody so much. How you doing everyone? Uh, one of our walls is literally missing. <laughs> huh? The, the, the killing her pallet. You don't see it behind you. I mean, there is a wall there. It's a window. Uh, there is? Oh, yeah. well, they're hitting shit through the wall. Need food before I can... Okay, I gotta go. Oh, good. I'm breaking things I don't want to be breaking. Oh, God. No, those aren't still set to <laughs> the scare alert. Thank you so much, Bree, for the 366 bits. That that wouldn't have been a scare alert anyway if those were still set. But I'm going to change my weapon. What are you doing at this rune table? Yeah. No, they were just hitting this wall. They weren't attacking things through it. But this no, those are those are still those are turned off again. Thunder strike does damage. Yeah, it's like a proc chance for extra damage or something. Well, it says a shockwave that knocks enemies back. I wonder if it does damage. Too. I'll try it. I have it on my axe right now, and I haven't seen it do any. Uh, uh. Knockbacks. <clears throat> you ready to go down the elevator of Mordor? Yep. All right, taking the map stone of Mordor. Thanks everybody so much for all the uh, all the hype. Appreciate it. Hope y'all are doing well. I'll figure that out some other time. Oh God, bring me. Yeah. Yeah, we've had enough black diamond to repair this thing. Um, there's a like orc town that you can go to that has a boss in it, and we got like 20 black diamond from killing him. You just yump off of that.
Oh, it's decided now, finally, to teach us to build rope ladders. There's a lot of purple shit down there. Yeah, there's some shit going on down there. In hindsight, I should have taken some all of the black diamonds with me in case we needed them. I'm dying. Are you also dying? No. Why are you dying? Hello? Okay, good talk. Can you not? What the fuck? Hello, can you hear? Okay. Yeah. Are you dying? I'm just wary. Uh. In despair. I'm not in despair. What the fuck am I in despair? I don't know. Bone cold, Did you wary. Get cursed again? No. Wary, bone cold, darkness, despair. Weird. <clears throat> also, apparently, the Twitch, like, one of the things that I use for my stream, if I happen to have it focused, my push to talk stops working, which doesn't make any ah. sense. Oh, uh, just gotta make some ladders. Put a ways down. Uh, I'm gonna die probably, by the way, so you're gonna have to arrest me. You're taking it too now. I am. It's so whenever we cross the bridge. We need to go back up, like we're just gonna die. Well. Do we have some, like... And I have food, it's just unlimited. I'm about to go down. Maybe if you res me, I'll go away and then I can res you. Yeah. Did you rebuild the hoist? Is that how we're down here? Yeah. Okay. I'm going down. I'll rub some stone on it. <laughs> nope, back to despair. I'm about to go down again, probably. Oh. Thing seems not correct. Yeah, well, I mean, just gonna grab have to those. Okay. But I mean, it's just, it's a permanent dot. Yeah, it should. We need to find light to recover, it says. Um, That's what it said last time, too, but the torch isn't enough. Right. I'm wondering if the crystal light is. But we need to find a way to get up. Uh, I'm dead. I'm just going to res and run back and grab my shit. Uh, okay. Because I, I want to see at least at, at which point that curse starts. Because it definitely didn't start right away. Might be some quest text about it that we haven't really been reading. Yeah, I still am on the quest to repair the thing. <laughs> well. Oh my god, these fucking bats. I got up a bit and it went away. Uh, hmm. Like, I got up to where that ladder is. Oh, you know what? It's because it's now first light. So I'm not in darkness anymore. We just came down at a stupid time. Oh, like, we have to go down during dawn only? During daytime, yeah. See, now right, dawn is at hand. Yeah. 
Uh, I'm going to come back to base and resupply a bit, though. Yeah, I don't know why there's no stairs or ramps in this. That's like... That's one of the things that does really frustrate me about this. Like, why can't I build a set of stairs? But I have to do this. You just now found out Spencer is Canadian? Why do you think he was role-playing as Ontario Jones for the entire time we were on Nordheim? <laughs> he assumed he was from Texas? I don't, I, I, I don't, he understands normal people. You realize that, uh, uh, I'm going to go change it into dry clothes before heading down. I, hear me. Um, I'm going to take an opportunity to AFK real quick as well then, chat. Um, we will just be a moment. I just need to uh, sort a couple things out. Order pizza. Just found the Ark Stronghold. Nice. All right. I'll be back in just a few minutes. I'll give you a little chill music to relax while I'm AFK. I'll be right back.
right, I'm back. I think he's ready to get is this for me or for you. Josh. Josh. Oh god, what's happening? Oh god. What the fuck did you do? We're get the base is fucking getting attacked. You're okay. And I think we got my shit, I couldn't defend it. You mean come back as their lot? I got it. Literally just okay. I just picked my shit up and I was starting to run back. Did you go to make pizza? What? Did you go to make a pizza? Uh I was ordering a pizza. Yeah, I can't wait for pizza. Sorry for that Hilton pizza. I like that Hilton pizza this time. Am fan. Bronze, so we need iron. And I wonder if we make like a camp fire if it's light enough. You can make a campfire thing. I don't know what that all entails. Yeah, what I was saying, if it will prevent that shit from happening. Oh, yeah, not sure. All right, one second, chat. I need to make sure that my order went through. One second.
a kind of like a spider room halfway down that it could turn into like a little base. I don't know if it's worth though. It's not that far down yet. Looks like it did. I really wish I knew why this shit just falls the fuck apart. Like, there's no reason for that. I need to put like a fucking wall somewhere. I don't understand at all what the problem with this is. I just want to go up there. survive somehow. I'm in the middle of fucking nowhere. I don't understand, chat. I really don't know why this fucking ladder doesn't work. Reasons entirely unclear that one worked. Oh, shit, dude. Got Uber Sam Wood. Nice. It came from mushrooms. That has given us the ability to make a pier, which can only be built on water. Huh. As well as a loom. And a pallet.
I really don't get why sometimes these work and sometimes they don't. the debuff again and I don't think I'm long for this world of course that one doesn't work yeah it's night time yeah we gotta die it's fine very close to the bottom I built like a path all the way down more or less Oh, okay. I built the second floor. So we have more space to put shit. Oh, nice. By the way, there's a bigger, newer base down there, so. <laughs> well, good. I hate this one. I, I don't actually know what there is. Probably is, though. Support in this works is absurd. Was that so? Basically, because I don't understand it yet, and it's weird. Yeah. But like, you have to jump at the top. By the way, because also you can't put a rope wall at the edge of a floor. You have to put a fucking uh. flat. It's I. I'm starting to really hate the base building in this. I don't think base building is this game's intended forte, probably. Probably not. Which also explains why there's no fucking, like... Free building? It's all just, like, half pre-made stuff? Yeah, I mean, we could free build if we wanted, but yeah. there's no, like, there's no... There's a bunch of pieces that are not existent that would, like, you can't build stairs, TLDR. There's right. no stairs. There's no ramps. There's no... But there's ladders. There are ladders, but they don't yeah, fucking snap the things properly, and they're stupid. Mm -hmm. Like, why is this the size of three quarters of a floor? <laughs> this is fucking weird.
Dad, can we have a sleepy poo to pass the time? Sure. Put food on real quick. You already port back or something? Yeah, I'm running back down to my body now. Oh, gotcha. Take one of the meats and our foods and slay you. Oh, good news. I fell down all the way and died. <laughs> Wait, did... <laughs> see... Wait, really? What? Oh, no, there's bats attacking me on a ladder. I'm vulnerable. The bats are so fucking frustrating in this. Just like weirdly S key all the time. Yeah. <laughs> Fight them. Oh, at least I put all my stuff, like, at the top of the... Oh, that's good. That'd be fucking terrible. Yeah. Like, where I fell from, not where I fell yeah. from. Oh, I forgot to update. There we go. Forgot to update my Twitch title ages ago. Oh, cool. And just while we're away, half of the shit that I built is just randomly falling apart for inexplicable reasons. <laughs> like, I don't... Like the second floor? Yeah, like... I came back there and there's beam? just a bunch of wood on the floor. There should be. It's just fucking ceiling. Like, if you have to put a support beam under every fucking ceiling that you put up in this game, then I'm not going to bother. Like, that's... that's Yeah, fair. Too much. Surprised you haven't been bothering in the first place to be honest in this game, but... Well... Like, not because the game's bad, but, like, building's not its forte, and... Yeah. It's going to be, be relocating bases. We've done it three times already. I was trying to, like, just get extra space for storage, basically. Yeah, and then you just get into it. I got you. Yeah.
know how the poop made it over here, but. say I updated a while ago. Well, I didn't see that. All right, I need to AFK for just a minute to grab. Yeah, this co-op up to eight people for a world. Correct. Yeah. Uh, but I need to AFK just one minute to grab food. I'm going to grab pizza, which got here lightning fast. I'll be right back. Okay. Be right back, chat.
All right. I'm back, chat. Here's what we got to do. Here's what we got to do. What kind of pizza? We got Domino's. In fact, we have to we have to talk about it for a minute because Domino's sent me the pizza. Specifically, they sent me where the fuck is the button? Uh, uh, start this because boom, and come over here for a second. The I have a have a, a little sponsored segment where we need to talk about the Domino's cheesy bread. We're gonna give it a try, see what it's like. The pepperoni stuffed cheesy bread. Yeah, let me grab one. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm popping this open. Let's let's try the Domino's. Oh, it's really really warm. The pepperoni stuffed cheesy bread. Here, have a look. Cheesy bread with pepperoni in it. It's very warm. Burning my hand slightly. I need to have significantly more space at my desk than I currently have. Uh, I also need a napkin pretty desperately. There we go. I'm going to give it a try. Oh, that's super good, actually. Oh, that's super good. Hmm, interesting. Tastes just like Domino's. I mean, it's delicious. Hmm. Is there enough for chat to try it? So, the way this bounty worked was they sent me a gift code. Um, or gift card so that I could order it. Uh... And they also had a deal going on right now where it was like seven bucks for the cheesy bread. So I got a bunch of different stuff. They want me to mostly talk about the pepperoni stuff, cheesy bread during this though. We'll talk about some of the other stuff a little bit. Um, that's chicken. Yeah, that's the other. I know. I'm going to try. I have some other sauces to try dipping it into. I'm going to try dipping it in the ranch. Let's try the pepperoni stuff stuff in the ranch all right there we go mm-hmm mm-hmm oh man that's good like I'm not I'm not even just like blowing smoke because I'm getting paid for this chat like this is good That's really good. Mm. I like the ranch so much, I almost don't want to try the other ones, but I do want to at least try the garlic. I have a marinara sauce also. I think I can kind of guess how the marinara sauce is going to taste, but... Let's try the pepperoni cheesy bread and the garlic butter. Oh man, look at that. Look at that. Hmm. Yeah, that's not bad either. I like the ranch more. I do like the ranch more. The garlic butter is a little bit too salty for me. That ranch is really good, though. Um, <clears throat> let's grab another piece of this. Oh, there's also a song that they want me to play. I almost forgot. Hold on. Let me get some of this in my mouth. Mm hmm. That was very good. 
this is the best bounty I've done in a while because it's just mostly me getting to eat pizza. <laughs> Specifically, like, they call it pepperoni stuffed cheesy bread. And that's not an inaccurate statement. It's almost, I think if there was marinara in it, it would basically be a calzone. It's not though. Hold on, let's find this, let's find this song they want me to play. Hold on. If this is, if this is what I think it is, this is going to be very funny. Um, hold on. I need to make sure, I need to make sure that I play it in a way that sticks on the VOD. So I actually have to open it on my other computer real quick because of how I have my sound set up. Uh, what do I need? I need this over here. I need another bite of cheesy bread with the ranch on the pepperoni. Oh, I need to not throw it on the floor. Saved that last second. Good job, me. Okay, here we go. Let's see if I can play this song. They took the pepperoni, stuffed it in the cheesy bread. They took the pepperoni, stuffed it in the cheesy bread. They took the pepperoni, stuffed it in the cheesy bread. Yummy, tasty pepperoni, stuffed inside a cheesy bread. Well, there's a very sudden end to it, but it's tasty. Vod muted, better not, better not. All right, let's real quick. They have another stuffed cheesy bread as I accidentally turned down my microphone. All right, we're gonna try this one too, as I continue making a massive mess of, all over myself. This one is the spinach and spinach and something, spinach and some other kind of cheese. Hmm, that's good too. I shouldn't have dipped it in the ranch before I tried it the first time. No, I really like that too. We're gonna try that one in the garlic butter, actually. I am making a massive mess out of myself at the moment. Fortunately, my girlfriend is amazing and brought me napkins. No, that's really good too. The, what the heck was that? Uh, where's my receipt? Here it is. Spinach and feta. That's what it was. Spinach and feta stuffed. All right. We're gonna, we're gonna play this again. They took the pepperoni, stuffed it in the cheesy bread. They took the pepperoni, stuffed it in the cheesy bread. <laughs> Truly the song of a generation. Truly the song of a generation. Well, thanks, uh, thanks, Domino's, for that. I need to fix my stuff now. <clears throat> Come back over here. That's the that's the song, by the way. 
chat. Uh, let me actually close some stuff so I don't accidentally show things on stream that I shouldn't. Okay, there we go. Boom. I have so much more food sitting around here. Like, we ordered pizza also. I'm going to have, like, leftovers for days. In fact, I'm going to clean up a little bit. And put some stuff away before we go again. Be right back, All right, we go. Dynamic. Hello. How are things? Uh, well, a lot of stuff's happened. I built the new mining pick. Oh. And I left all the stuff you need for the new mining pick up there. Oh. Uh, also, there's stairs now. Really? Yeah. Granite stairs. Oh, fucking. And they must have just hotfixed it because I heard you bitch about it. They probably did, yeah. They were like... They were like, fine, here you go. Oh, what is... A ton of fluorescent mushrooms down here, which is the Uba Sam wood. Oh, interesting. <clears throat> also, this new thing I assume is good for gold and silver and all those precious gems that we have like a million of. Yeah. Did you find a, another map stone down there? Nah, you have to come down manually. But what if I warp to this map stone that it shows? Nah, I wouldn't recommend that. You know, you say that, we got orcs. but I probably shouldn't have done this. Are you weary? I am. And starving. Let's go back up. And being attacked by orcs. But there's orcs down here? I haven't seen any. Well, they're here on me, beating my ass. You run to me, there's safety here. Ish. I don't know where you are. I just look to spin around the map. Yeah, 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 I'm running. Uh oh, this pulsing thing. I think there's hordes down here again. Probably. Can't hear this torch. It's safe. Yeah, this friend's coming. Yep. I need a better weapon for this. Oh, these guys are giga. Achievement. Bloom. Quiet. Bloom. I see way ahead. Ah. 
Well, that was fun. All right. Little poison mushrooms and shit around, so be careful. You can also harvest blazing shroom. Moss. So basically any of these mushrooms are the good stuff. Yeah, okay. This is how we get the uber Sam wood. It's apparently if you build a standing torch, it gets rid of the darkness and stuff. Hmm. There's a bunch of salt here. And granite, which you can use for stairs. All right. I miss when they used to sing about eating spiders. Uh, me too. Now it's all farm this and orc that. This place is pretty cool looking. Kind of statue. Great sword. Oh, uh, yeah, there's a new sword recipe. It's tier three. Mm. One hander <clears throat> takes ruby and silver. Stairs are pretty big compared to upstairs. Another squire. Ready, sir. Mm, I'm ready too, sir. I discovered a new ale recipe too that makes you immune to poison, which we might need because mm. I keep getting poisoned. Made you want pizza, so I'm cooking. <laughs> for that new chest we just made. <laughs> yeah. All right, chicken. Roasting pit. Hmm. <clears throat> Got pieces you get? Uh, I got thin crust pizza with, uh, ham and mushroom on it. I don't remember. With ham and mushroom on it. Oh, I'm in mushroom. Oh, good. I don't know where you are either. There's a horde coming. Oh, I went back up. <clears throat> oh, well then. I needed food.
Oh, we can make a tiled hearth now, too. Yeah. Which I assume has a larger radius. So as you can... I think we could build other things near it, too. <clears throat> and cook better meals. There's like big dudes here and shit. Yeah, I'm teleporting back down now. I mean, I'm like relatively safe. I'm just carrying like a bitch in a corner, but <laughs> there's like new enemies and I think they're all like gray damage armor and stuff. <clears throat> I'm coming. There's no rush. They're also like fighting each other or something. Oh, they are fighting each other. Interesting. Easy though. I am not. Uh, it's good. Yeah, you will probably like it. It's spinach and feta. I wonder if they want us to like build our own base at that one map stone that's just completely by itself. Maybe. I think that was more of a uh, congratulations you got down that climb. Never have to do it again now. Uh, yeah. That's what it feels like to me. Victory, apparently. Oh, inventory's full. Don't worry, I have arrived to pick up all of the things. All right. Uh, there's like, um, careful, those mushrooms are poisonous. There's a um, little camp here we can clear out. <clears throat> the goblin variety. Oh, I'm very full on shit, so. Well, my charged attack with this axe just one shot a big guy. Oh, really? Nice. Yeah. There, Jenny. Yeah, Ted thinks he's very funny. Yeah, that did 152 damage. Damn. I should just go get that. Bunch of silver and shit here. Did we not get the key? I don't know. 
Oh, here it is. It just they broke their own thing. Yeah, there was fighting there before. What was the Ashna Raz? I What's found a new chance? gem. Yeah. What is it? Amethyst. Put me out of my misery. <laughs> my guy's exhausted. Oh, that's like another goblin stronghold here. Deep orcs warren. Feeling he's gonna lead to another boss. I need like rest before that. Oh yeah, this definitely this looks the same as the other one. Yeah. A few more ways to go from that big main room that we started in. DoorDash driver just stole your order? What the fuck? Good news, I forgot that that was poisonous. It takes for, well, it's, it's very Dark Soul style. It's going to be about two thirds of your health as up. Are you heading back to base or? Yeah, my guy's like exhausted as fuck. All right. I don't have too long left tonight, BT dubs either. All right. Get a heady soon. Oh, fuck. We have like a hundred orcs here. In fact, maybe a good time to rest up if I'm going to go rest now, unless you want to push another 20 30. I'm good either way. Always sleep. Make some food. <clears throat> this area is cool, though. Yeah. 
I'm I'm liking this game a lot. I'm interested to learn if eventually the base building becomes like a real thing or if it continues to we, just be. We got so many new materials. We're gonna need like eighteen yeah. more chests. But we need like a bigger space. Is the thing. Yeah. yeah. Well, we must find a new hub down there again. That's right, what I was just seeing. Build wherever the fuck we want, but. <clears throat> Gonna put stuff away real quick. This game needs to fix its like shit with depositing. Yeah. CBA. Why do I gotta do this? Oh, I mind a lot of salt. Wait, is there salt palette actually? There's a silver ore palette. There is not a salt one. I don't think. There's granite. There's uber sand wood. <clears throat> I built an uber sand wood, by the way, near the waypoint. Okay. Um, and then there's a silver one as well. Could build a silver one here. Apparently bones are a thing now too. Yeah. These oh, you journal five page. rangers baits. No, they're different different journal. Oh uh, wait, so we didn't find the original. We didn't, yeah. There's one in the mines somewhere still for us to find. Hmm. I also found Onyx. I'm done patrolling. It's time to eat. Mm, eat. Get away with that three times a month with no repercussions. That's bizarre. <clears throat> Make a granite pellet as well. All right, so cozy in here and nowhere to move. Yeah. Ever wonder what sunlight feels like? <clears throat> well, there's a fourth chest up there now. <laughs>
I right, stop here. Let me know near Gucci. I'm good. <clears throat> All right. Go again tomorrow. Uh, should be able to. Yeah. Uh, oh, the only reason I won't wouldn't be able to is if I get early access on week two, but it doesn't look like I will, so I should be All good right. to go. Just heads up if I do. Oh, we'll let you know. I see you tomorrow. So you. Get... <clears throat> All right, chat. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna come over here real quick. And see if Arc 2 ever actually released. Sorry, not Arc 2. Arc whatever it is. Arc again. Well, I still can't install it, so I'm assuming it has not released yet. <clears throat> yeah, you're still streaming more? Yeah. Hey, right, cool. Let's see what we can find out. <clears throat> Ted with the raid. Welcome, everybody. All right. See you tomorrow. Sleep. Uh, looks like Ark isn't out yet. Um, <clears throat> it was supposed to come out ages ago today. Last update was supposed to come out 23 minutes ago. I haven't heard it yet. So here's what we'll do. Here's what we'll do for the short term. We will... Um, um, I still haven't finished uh, Ghost Runner 2. So we can hop on that for a bit while we wait and find out if Arca is ever going to release. Um, so I think we'll do that. Live under a rock. What's this about Arc? It's not even a live under a rock thing. They just decided today was the day that they were going to release Arc Survival Ascended. The like Unreal 4 or Unreal 5 remaster of Arc. They just was like, yep, it's coming out today. But then, like, even though they announced the release date was today, today, they're, they're also missing that release date. <laughs> like, <laughs> this is, it's actually insane how, like, how do you do that? How do you say, yep, it's coming out right now? but then still don't make it right now. Like <laughs> when your release date slips within 45 minutes of you announcing the release date, let's be, we'll, we'll be fair. We'll be fair within three hours of you announcing the release date and your release date already slips. That's some, that's some shit. That's some shit. So we're going to pop back into ghost runner. <clears throat> 
Uh, go. Let me update my Twitch. Come back over here. <clears throat> I haven't heard the Intel sound in ages. Skill Spanner 2. There we go. <clears throat> What's up, Pate Pate? I need to see if I can get Ted to try this game. I think he would either really like it or really, really not. <laughs> Plug me if it happens. Okay, cool. Yeah, let me know if I should hop on something else. Otherwise, we're just gonna chill on Ghost Runner for the time being. Hello, can we talk? So, we're running out of time. Not yet. I know. It's just. <sighs> Huh? Making a damn mess. You okay? Not really. No, this isn't what I wanted. This isn't even what I feared. What did you fear? <clears throat> After the Keymaster died, I was sure everything would fix itself. That we were days away from a happily ever after. Weeks tops. I thought the worst that could happen was for the climbers to grow unnecessary, uh, obsolete. For us all to grow fat and old and complacent and secretly miss the days when we used to smuggle contraband break into warehouses and vandalize keymaster posters when we used to stand up for something how could i be so dumb <laughs> how can anyone don't give that up <clears throat> don't give what? that up those fears you might grow fat and old and complacent yet i might maybe just not this year huh Probably not. Zoe, I will take care of him. I promise. Now, where's the wing thing? Kira just finished working on it. Do you need any tips on how to use it? Genji, is that you? Oh, this man. game is basically Genji Simulator. So, <clears throat> this is it? This is not a goodbye, Zoe. I'll be back. I'll just be back. Just in case you're not. Thank you for everything. You're. Welcome, Zoe. Sounds kind of like we're about to start the last mission. on fire control midair to activate the wingsuit steer down while the wingsuit is active to gain speed. oh well let's give it a try just stay away from the sun <sighs> holy shit it works are you surprised just excited you think i would give it to you if i didn't expect it to work i hope not have some trust on a serious note <laughs> Wingsuit is new. Whoops. Down we go. Okay.
All right, let's do this. There we go. That was smart. There's something above me. It's up there. How do I get up to that? There we go. We got a grappling hook. All right. Where am I supposed to go? That was pretty sick. No, I missed. down here. <clears throat> Listen, I'm gonna have to focus here. We'll talk later, okay? All right. Watch out. Yeah, good luck out there. That was pretty cool. Love cyberpunk. This game has a really good, like, atmosphere and so on to it. <clears throat> Unless you do cool shit like that. Ooh, pass through all the cyber gates. All right, here we go. Do not see where the next one is. Oh, it's all the way down there. All right, we uh, leave challenge. Let me try again.
Because the uh, wingsuit is a little finicky. in the top okay nope, not restart level new challenge mostly just figuring out the like I have to kind of know where I'm going in advance on this one because enough of it what am I trying to say there's enough about it that's a little bit odd Damn it. 
if you like touch a wall at all, it gets weird. Not really sure that was what I was supposed to do there, but it works. button. Forgot I saw shadow selected. Okay, that wasn't really how I was supposed to do that, but it worked. The label claims that bulofedrin is a mixture of anabolic steroids, pheromones, and some amino acid supplements. The cap doesn't come off easily. If you can, if you find one of these bottles on the streets, you can be sure it no longer holds what it says on the tin. The gangs fill them with bullshit chemicals like non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs. The crushed glass is added for extra sensations in case you snort it. What the fuck? Council could use your help. Helping them would mean hunting others. I don't want that. So what you're saying is, you're just going to exist there. Whatever that means, yes. I reject any further participation in reality. What if the power goes out? One day, it will for everyone.
Yo, what's up, Pat? I think we're on like close to the last level. The game's at least setting up like it's close to the last level. Oh god, I missed that there was stuff on the wall. What do I think about the wingsuit? It's a bit finicky. I'm getting the hang of it. Except for when I do that. <clears throat> or that. I do have to say, I think... Um, I don't think the game needed it, if that makes sense. Okay. I need to have Tempest ready. Like, it's fun. That was the wrong button. That was the wrong button. We did everything wrong. I'm so... Every time I have Tempest equipped, because it's so similar to... Um, honestly, it might just be that it reminds me of the Warlock like melee attack in Destiny 2. I end up pressing F instead of Q to use it. Even though I don't have a problem pressing Q for everything else. Barely made that. All right, we're through. Okay. We're gonna need shadow equipped here. Ah, hold on. I thought that probably wasn't gonna work, but I wanted to find out. But like for me, the core gameplay of Ghost Runner is so much fun that I'm almost I like our chances for defeating Mitra. Yeah. I'm not sure. If we make it before him, I'd say our chances are looking optimistic. If we don't, I guess it's not our problem anymore. Fair. That's weirdly comforting. You're welcome. Uh, I think the core mechanics of, Ga of Ghost Runner are so strong that, like, the big open world level where you're on the bike the whole time and you're driving around, um, and, like, the wingsuit and some of the other, like, little things also feel like they take away from what is a really fun core loop to me instead of adding to it, if that makes any sense. It's like, it's like you're on a date with someone and they are beautiful and you can tell that they just put a little bit too much makeup on and they were trying a little bit too hard. That, that's kind of the feeling that I get. Like, oh no, I love everything that's underneath so much. You didn't need to put on this extra dressing. Like, yeah, Ghost Runner 1 speedrun was, is crazy. But it is still fun, don't get me wrong. 
even with the side stuff that I'm not as big of a fan of. I'm only not as big of a fan of it because I like the core gameplay so much. Okay, we can totally do this. I could totally reset and go back down, but I feel like I can get this. There we go. Hell yeah. <laughs> Strats. I'm really excited to see the speed run for this actually start to come together also. I might I might actually do some speed running of it myself depending on how the run shapes up. Go upper right first. Get that guy's flying a little bit higher. Gotcha. The more I get the hang of the wingsuit, the more I like it. There was some really cool stuff with the bike, too. like I can. <laughs> I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do that. In fact, I'm almost certain that's not how you're supposed to do that. But that's how I did it.
I never figured out where that first one went. Forgot that that worked that way. So hard to get behind those guys sometimes. Okay, I got another plan.
Fuck. Oops. Oops. Something a little bit there. I have somehow escaped the death plane. Interesting. Okay, I'm going back to what I was doing before. No. Okay, that'll actually work if I do it right. That did not work. I accidentally hit the ground.
keep losing track of where the other guy is. understand what's happening when I break that orb up there. Is it killing the other guys? Because after I break it, I'm having trouble finding them again. And normally those orbs are just like a shield. Improvising. All right, it was left. getting hung up on the rail and not realizing it.
Star. Come up here quick like get shot in the face. Alright. Come over here. Jump up on the wall. Reflect the shot. Reflect the shot. There we go. Did it too late. Jump up on the wall. Reflect the shot. Jump up on the other wall. Reflect the other shot. Didn't work. That's fine. We just kill him. Go through the door. Bounce up here. Wingsuit. Shuriken. Grapple. Come back up over here. Blink back between these two guys. That missed. But that's fine. That's not fine. That look better. That was an error. I fell off. Okay, that worked out. Got it. Finally. Hypocrisy much? Oh, I was supposed to... I see now. Took too 
on. Okay. No Rav back for 108 months. What's up, dude? Hope you're good. Thank you so much for the 108. That's a fucking lot of months. Many, many months. Indeed. We are too late. No. Mitra. Number. Right on time. You're alone. Give up. You still don't get it, do you? There is nothing left to give up. Stop this madness, Mitra. Rahu. Well, now it got interesting. This is your last chance to give up. And you really think I'm going to take it? The other option is death. Choose carefully. Already did. So be it. Come here, you soulless piece of shit! I'll wipe that floor with your corpse! Sure what the timing on that slow-mo one is supposed to be. I really don't get what the timing on that is supposed to be with the slow mo. I command 
you to strike me. Come here, you soulless piece of shit. I wonder if I'm just supposed to hold the button down. I'll wipe the floor with your corpse. That all you got? You think you can win? You think you can win? Stupid machine. Yeah, I'm just supposed to hold the button down. I was just tapping it. I'll make you all pay. totally doable at this point I'm just seeing if I can do it get that up why am I not getting the jump why is the jump not going through? am I jumping too late I had the, like, it worked like seven times and then suddenly, no, it's not working. Y'all hot fixing this game live on me? See, that worked that time. Yeah. 
vengeance. To be honest, I didn't expect much from you. Shut up and fight! I hate you so much! I'll cut you like a pig! Shit. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. I almost had it. Not very nice, Mika.
Rogue AI believes himself to be a real human being. You despise us, not realizing you're one of us. A tragedy, really. I almost feel sorry for you. This is where it ends, Mitra. I know you didn't choose your fate, but all of this could have been avoided. You're the one who chose this, and it's time to pay the price. Ninety nine deaths, not a hundred, just ninety nine. That's all I needed. I, uh, thanks for everything, Kevin. Take care of yourself. Um, beep. <laughs> Understandable. Have a good day. Nothing more from the peanut gallery. Hi, Saul. Hi, Jack. Well done with everything. Thanks. No, we're the ones who are thankful, though. At this point, words won't do it justice. What are you up to? Don't even start. So many people are injured. I'm basically a full-time doctor now. Except nobody is really paying me. Eh. I made such a massive mess. Listen, Saul. I'll be leaving Dharma. Not even surprised. Why? I mean, come on. You've been playing a hero ever since you woke up. How soon before it becomes a chore? How many thank yous can you receive before you're sick of them? I believe that you will be happy with that choice. There has to be so much to see out there. I'm almost jealous. I'm glad you understand. Ah, that's the least I can do. But don't worry. Everyone will understand. It's been a pleasure. The pleasure's been all mine. Also, glad I had a chance to be on your side. Those poor bastards who weren't. Nah, I'm joking. They all had it coming. Lesson here is be nice to people. Otherwise, shit happens. Goodbye, Jack. Goodbye, Saul. Hi, Zoe. Hi, Jack. You made it back. Told you I would. Yeah. So, what's the status? They're not a threat to us anymore. <sighs> That's a relief. What are you going to do next? We should start getting in touch with the survivors after we take care of the remaining Scions. I believe peace will be much easier to achieve when we deal with the issue. If not, well, we'll see. Sounds like a plan. Zoe, I... I'll be leaving Dharma. What? Are you serious? I'm sorry. No, it's... alright, it's just... unexpected. I know. 
I realized very recently that's what I want to do after this whole mess is over. I... understand. Will you manage without me? We will. Don't you worry about that. But Arc is out, by the way. We will okay, miss cool. you. I think we're in wrap-up at this point. I'll miss you too, Zoe. Will you ever come back? Maybe. We'll see. So... I'm not good at goodbyes. Don't know what to say. It's okay. Take care, Zoe. You're a great leader. Don't forget that. You're a great friend, Jack. The best out there. Don't forget that. Hi, Kira. Hi, Jack. Can't believe you actually pulled it off. It's crazy. Can't believe it myself, to be honest. What do we do about the Scions? Well, I'm almost done cooking up a solution. Wouldn't call it my magnum opus, but it's pretty impressive nonetheless. What is it? A Scion pesticide. A uh, cyanide? <laughs> the only thing worse than that joke is them wiping out humanity. Or what's left of it, at least. I learned from the best. Huh. It's quite ironic. You were very excited about Scions. You know what I'm excited about more? Actually helping for once. Fixing this shit up. This is my first step. What are your plans for the future? I'm going to stay here and help with the Interface Council. That's great to hear. Glad you like the idea. Figured it's a goal worth pursuing for a bit. Gonna sound cheesy, but this place is full of hope, in a way. I mean, what else is there to do in Dharma? Don't feel like joining any of those other nut jobs, thank you very much. And the outside doesn't seem as safe as I thought. Not yet. What about you? I'm leaving Dharma. Huh? Is that all right with you? It doesn't matter. Like, of course I'm gonna miss you, but if that's what you want, you should go for it. And nobody should tell you otherwise. Though, you could totally stop by with some soil samples now and then. No promises, but I'm glad you understand. Of course I do. Take care out there, Jack. It's been a ride. Sure was. You take care too, Kira. Hey, Adrian. Hey, Jack. How are you holding up? You kidding? You tell me. Ashura is no longer a threat to us. You did it, huh? Shit, how did it go? Well, I'm here. Ashura isn't. But Scions are still inside the tower. Don't worry. I overheard Kira mentioning something about it. it sounded pretty optimistic. Anyway, how are you? Better. Almost done regrouping, I guess. That's good to hear. What are you going to do now? Well, I heard Zoe wants to promote me to something. I guess that's still up to debate. Looks like you finally got on her good side. Yeah, seems like it. So, are you staying? As long as they want me to. We'll see how it goes. Listen, I, uh, I'll be leaving Dharma. What? Yeah. Oh, where do you plan to go? I'm not sure yet, but this is what I want to do. Will you manage? Don't worry, Jack. Dharma is in the right hands. Good. So this is it? It's been a pleasure to meet you, Adrian. Same. Good luck out there. Thanks. Good luck to you, too. Hmm.
Being a ghost runner is a never ending struggle. The lines between right and wrong are blurry. Which voice do you listen to? Did we never put Rehu back? I feel like we missed... I feel like we forgot something. Interesting. Super fun game. Super fun. There are there are bits of the story that I'm I'm like, because we promised Rehu we were gonna put him back in the um, cyber void, but after we beat Mitra, it was just kind of like. There was, there was no wrap up on that. So that's kind of a big question mark still. Like, do we, did that happen off screen? Did that, is Rehu still palling around with us? This song's kind of a jam. Hey, look, there's Pat. Oh, super fun game. I wonder if they're setting up for like a third. 
like a Ghost Runner 3, I'd be super down for it. Or for even DLC for this game. They were like, here's a new chapter that you can download and play. I'd be all over that. Well, chat, we're going to finish watching the, um, the credits because that's just how I am. Um, but then I think we're going to see about download an arc. Oh, God. The credits are like overlapping each other. Wait, what's happening? We'll get, um, we'll get through the credits here and then we'll start downloading ARC. Recognize some of these names. Yeah, these are very long credits. Let's take off every every beta tester. I mean, it's cool that they listed off the beta testers. That's actually pretty badass, but it does mean these credits are very long. swamped right now you know the drill oh gr74 it said interesting So that definitely seems like it's setting up for some future updates or combat or combat content or something. Interesting. All right. I'm going to hit this button real quick, chat. I'm going to take an AFK while we download Arc. We'll probably be hitting up more Ghost Runner in the future. 
Um, in fact, I, I know we'll be hitting up more Ghost Runner in the future. The game was super fun. Um, I was told that Ark was downloadable, but it does not seem to be the case. Oh, there it goes, finally. Just took ages for the install button to actually show up. Oh, God. This is going to be a slow download. All right, chat. We're going to... We'll give you some of this real quick while I AFK. Maybe. If the button will work. There we go. That'll 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 do. All right, I'm gonna AFK real quick, chat. I'll be right back.
Okay, I'm 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 chat. Okay, I'm back. I almost said okay, I'm chat. Uh, let's update our Twitch info. Too. No, it's me. I'm chat. Hello. So we're downloading Arc. We're at 38%, which is better than I had expected, to be honest. Trying to get, trying to get a handle on what's going on arc-wise. the ability to have private servers yet so we may end up just poking around in single player Sounds like we might be losing the fog runner in uh, Atlas. is still about it's only about 60% downloaded I'm trying to figure out what we're doing server wise sounds like there may not be dedicated servers at the start 
which is fine. means that we'll probably have to just fuck around in single player for a bit. Resisting the urge to download Ark Survival Ascendant. The only reason, honestly, I wasn't going to play it and then they gave me a key. So I'm like, oh, fuck. If I have it for free anyway, I might as well look and see. also intrigued yeah i figure we'll we'll play it for a little bit and see show it off try and understand it let's try and figure out what if anything they've changed What's up, Dutchie? How's it going? Have I tested out AV1 encoding for YouTube streams yet? No, I have not um, because I'm dual streaming, so my encoder needs to be... I'm basically sending out one code or one um, one stream to restream, which is then broadcasting it to both. I could, I do have the internet speed. I could try doing two encodes and two, um, two broadcasts, but that would be pretty system intensive as well. So I don't know, we'll see. RP and Ascended, uh, it sounds like Nordheim is gonna set up a like, I was in the middle of a sentence and then lost it. Am 
modder. Yeah, I don't... Apparently, there's, like, no mods already, which I guess makes sense. Like, it's a UE5 re-release, so most of the mods are going to have to be completely redone. Um... So there's just not going to be mods for a while. And Arc Minus Mods has always been awful. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like Arc that much with mods. Yeah, Nordheim is setting up a server, but so here, here's the status on that. Um, the dedicated server tool is not available yet because um, Studio Wildcard is very good at releasing things on schedule. So, uh, that server will be up whenever they get around to allowing there to be servers. Like, apparently even, like, fucking Nitrado, who they've given exclusivity to for, like, commercialized hosting, doesn't have the ability to stand up dedicated servers yet. Like in Return to Moria? I'm really liking it. Yeah, no, it's really fun. Especially like co-op with Ted, it's been really fun. I've heard people saying that Solo, like Darkson earlier was saying that Solo Moria is tough because of the way the attacks work. Like there's a lot of times where our base will get attacked when it's me and Ted and he'll just continue doing whatever it was he was doing and I will um, defend the attack and we'll be fine. Um, but I'm sure it's still like, enjoyable. Uh, I was having a lot of fun. grab my not water it's rogue actually i'm gonna grab my rogue and then arc just finished downloading so we'll check it out be right back install battle eye now oh my god you know the con sickness today oh were they at twitchcon or something Well, 
Well, that was surprising. Oh, they're bringing back survival of the fittest. That's funny. Oh, there are some mods already. Interesting. There is an Arc 2 being developed also. This is the Unreal Engine 5 remaster of Arc. Uh, Arc 1. So I guess we do single player. I'm just going to do it on easy difficulty for now. this shit off. Let's see if turning off those fixes the frame rate. It's holy shit. So far, not a good experience. It's not fucking working. Hello? Lots of people are worried the game will have the feeling of freshly new cone of paint but kept the same issues. That is exactly what I'm expecting. I'm expecting it will be a prettier game that is still shit. So far, it's a non-functional game. I, I guess we just Alt F4, because it's just straight up not working. Third person to have issues on the settings screen. Like I'm I'm gonna be I'm gonna be just straightforward going into this chat. I don't like ARC. <laughs> <laughs> I've played a fair bit of Ark, and at the end of my experience with Ark, I realized I just wasn't having any fun. So we're gonna hope that it's wow, it's not even fucking ending. End task. There we go. We're gonna hope that updated Ark is more fun, but base Ark. I'll put it this way. Arc Survival Evolved, I don't enjoy. Arc Survival Evolved with no mods, I really don't like. So I'm starting, I'm starting from a place of probably not going to like this, but we're going to look at it and give it a fair shake anyway. Because they gave me a free key, so why not?
We're gonna try. We're gonna try just a single player game, not a self-dedicated. See if that will work. See if we can at least get to the point where we can turn down some of the fucking settings so this isn't at 20 frames per second. I like Conan the most of those that you listed. All right. Okay, these are like off now and I'm still getting a horrible frame rate. Like it did actually save Well, I didn't even change anything and now it's broken. Let's try it without Battle Eye. And we'll just do single player and we'll just try to get the game to fucking load. We're not even we're not even gonna mess with character creation just yet. We're just going to fucking try to get into the game. I've been waiting for. You might be. I hope so. It's been so many cycles since I was her. Do I even still remember hope? I wasn't sure you'd ever turn up. The odds just kept getting longer. I guess I've been losing faith. Well, they've been gaining power. You have to reach me. Everything depends on your survival. Master this world. Make allies of its many creatures. Grow your strength and skill. Explore this place like I did so long ago. Put the pieces together and find me, survivor. You may be the only one who can. Okay. Glad they still haven't fixed that. There's a dinosaur floating in the air. Oh God. Okay. Settings. Oh, there it is. Why the still too high and the graphics are still the frame rate is still shit i'll try seven thankfully i can save in this menu it seems p 
please tell me there's an option to turn off that fucking camera view bob off. Light camera. Keep switching your Google account every time you open YouTube. <laughs> Okay. Fuck. Why does this run like shit? We'll just set it to low. Everything to low. We'll start with that. We'll see. Okay, with everything on low, I'm getting 48 frames per second. Now sensitivity is still too high. Light boom. Oh, why did it get turned back on? We're going to li literally set everything to low and see what frame rate we can get. Turn everything off. Okay, with everything off, I can get 60 frames per second. But now it looks like utter shit. I'll be honest, I didn't like how it looked even with everything turned up. Set this to medium. Like turn off light boom and light shafts. Well, okay. So one of those settings is just fucking tanking the frame rate. Turn off shadow, turn down shadows. That helped. Global illumination quality. That also helped, but now it looks like a fucking How does this look so bad? Like... Is HDR on? Oh good, that button doesn't fucking work. Okay, now HDR is off. No, I'm just in single player right now because I'm trying to figure out how to make this game even remotely playable. If I don't get this playable in the next like 20 minutes, I'm just going to not play because right now I'm just fucking infuriated at how bad this is. Like. This actually looks worse than old Ark. with an even worse frame rate.
And like this, this is me trying to get it to a point where I got more than 20 frames per second. Let's, let's set this back to medium, which is what it defaulted to. This looks like okay. It looks fucking blurry is what it looks. Like. Hey chat. Watch the water near my head. You see that? Yeah, turn the light boom back off. Put post processing on low. Put post processing on high. Glad I didn't. I'm very glad I didn't pay for this. That, I wasn't going to pay for this. There was zero possibility of me paying for this. Like. Let's turn that stuff off. See what that does. That vaguely, that almost fixed it. There's still some weird pixelation around my head in the water. Which, by the way, looks like shit. You, you might be looking at that water chat and thinking, wow, the stream is really artifacting. It's not. That's what the water looks like. Goodbye then. All right, we're we're gonna do we're gonna do an experiment. I'm gonna set everything to epic, everything on. What is what is the best that this game can look? We're going to have shit for frame rate. Oh, I need to turn this RTX stuff back on. Oh, it is back on. now. Okay. What is super resolution? I wonder if that's what I need to change. Let's turn that off. So super resolution got rid of the no, never mind, it didn't actually get rid of the weird ghosting, it just made it look different. Now we're at ten frames per second.
Ultra Performance. Okay, so I think Super Resolution is NVIDIA's, like... Let's downsample everything. Like, it, it looks like I'm playing a Twitch stream right now. That's how gross the quality is. Okay. Put this back on medium. We'll turn off light bloom again. Turn off light shafts. Like half the settings I expect to see are not here. Like I, there isn't a turn off DLSS. So like there's a post processing. I could turn post processing to low, but I can't turn it off. This is the closest to playable I've been able to get. No, first person doesn't affect the frames. In fact, now it's 30 frames per second. Uh, oh, right. DLSS is there. Because they put it all in different fucking menus for reasons. Uh, that made it worse. It does get rid of the artifacting around my head, but it makes the frame rate worse. And even then, it doesn't actually get rid of the artifacting around my head. It just makes it look different. God, this water looks like shit. Holy fuck. I have another idea. Have another idea. Here's what we're gonna do. I haven't updated my graphics drivers in like two weeks. We'll try updating graphics drivers. It's probably been a little bit longer than two weeks, actually. I don't remember. I also doubt they've done anything specific for ARC, but I'm just trying everything that I can to make this game playable. I'm doing my due diligence. Like, I don't have the most up-to-date, like, graphics driver or graphics card. It's a 2080 Ti. It's a few years old. But this is the first new game, especially a UE5 game. This is the first one that I've ever had this bad performance on. And the whole fucking reason that they were upgrading to UE5 in the first place was for performance. I haven't seen the recommended for Alan Wake too. I don't really have any interest in Alan Wake. Jedi with the 34 months. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. I have a 3070, I'd probably have to run it on low settings. Did I launch the game already? Yes, and I'm now updating my video drivers in the hopes that it will make the game remotely playable. So far, the game is completely unplayable and looks hideous. Like, ugly and worse frame rate than Arc 1. <laughs> Uh, 
Hang next weekend? Hell yeah. Not like the trailers. Never believe a game trailer. Is the Arc Discord popcorn right now? New Star Citizen engine demo trailer? No, I haven't seen that either. I do want to check out Star Citizen again at some point. I saw they were talking about adding base building to Star Citizen, which is super interesting. All right. My graphics drivers are updated. Let's launch this shitty game again. We'll launch it with no battle eye, unofficial servers only. Just in case it's battle eye making the frame rate crap. All right. Where's cat? There's a cat down by my foot. She's sleeping. Like, <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm not going to be able to play at 25 frames per second. So we're going to have to go. Let's try just dropping the resolution. I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. In. What if we, we, we do this, if we leave that at the, no. Full screen, drop the resolution. How did dropping the resolution only gain me like six frames per second? Okay, so that's that's not the play. Yeah, I had it on lowest settings. So here's the problem. Okay. Here's what the game looks like right now. 
which I'm going to be honest, isn't very good. Just the amount of like weird artifact, like. If you guys can see the, the water. The water looks like. Looks like shit. Uncheck max frames. Set it to flat 60. All right. Yeah, the bird feeding is kind of cool. I'm only using a 2080 Ti also. It's true. Yeah. I'm only using a 2080 Ti. I have not had a game look this shit with this shit of a frame rate on my 2080 Ti. Especially on Unreal Engine 5. Like the whole fucking reason they even made this thing in the first place to go to Unreal Engine 5 was supposed to be for performance. My frame rate is currently 25 frames per second and the game looks like shit. We can go to low, low, low settings. Turn light bloom back off. Now I'm getting 41. This is almost playable. Hold on. I need to figure out if I can fix this camera shit too. Why is there disable on or off? That's a double negative. That's fucking confusing. Turn up the FOV. Maybe that will help. So you see how the camera is like slowly coming. I'm doing sudden quick jerks with my hand right now. Do you see how the camera is like slowing down to a stop at the end? I fucking hate that shit. It gives me motion sickness. And this is supposed to turn that off. That's what interpolation means, but that setting is not fucking working. Like this, this is the camera doing this for the so you're aware chat was why I quit Guild Wars 2 because it was just making me fucking motion sick like it makes the camera feel floaty and shitty and gross and it makes it difficult for me to track where my because I I my brain tells the camera to stop moving oh we got a drop look at that my brain tells the camera to stop moving but it's still moving afterwards well, that's kind of fucking cool, actually. I can't open it. Yeah, let's try a couple other camera settings. Camera shake scale. Zero. Save. That did not do anything. We can be to the side like Conan. That's actually a good feature to have.
that fixed it. Okay. I fixed it enough. I'm not I'm not getting motion sick just fucking looking around anymore. Okay. So what what did I just do? I had to set player camera mode to tight camera. What does this do? Oh, I can set it to the sit to the side in this too. It's kind of cool. Set it to like minus forty. Make it feel like Ark, but Conan. Okay, we're at a frame rate now that I can mostly stomach. It still hurts a bit, but I can mostly stomach it. And the game doesn't look like complete trash. We're getting there. Fuck me sideways. The water still looks like dog shit. But it does look better than it did. That is horrific. There's still a little bit of floatiness on the camera. Let's see what loose camera means. No, it's just the fucking light. That's actually... That's actually helping me a lot. The loose camera. Letting the character sort of run up ahead a bit. So that it's not following as closely. Turn up the FOV some more. Basically, right now, I'm trying to get to the point where I'm not fucking feeling sick to my stomach playing this game. Because I'm... It's definitely... I'm getting a little motion sick watching this. But we're getting there. We're getting there. We're making progress. I need to find a way to maybe save. What if we turn general shadows to medium? No, the lower shadow settings make the game instantly look like shit, and that didn't save me any frame rate. Foliage quality to medium. Somehow got worse. Okay. Okay, so the super resolution set. Look at my fucking hair now. The super resolution stuff, I think, is like. Um.
It's why parts of it start to look like a Twitch stream. Which can't then be coming through well on the actual Twitch stream. What the fuck is going on with my hair now? We'll check that advanced settings menu again in a second. Oh, super resolution is now off. No, DLSS is a different thing. The camera is far enough away that it's making my hair look weird for some fucking reason. So there's some video setting for that. Why does looking down zoom me out so fucking far? Go back to like 70 on this. Okay, at 70, my hair mostly still looks correct. What is DLAA? Oh, bad. That's bad. Oh, my God. I don't understand why it zooms out so far when I look down. We might literally just have to play mostly in first person. Because in first person at least it doesn't float the fuck around with the camera. fuck is going on with the clouds? I don't know how I'm going to get this to a point where like this is probably the best I'm going to be able to get it.
God. My expectations for this game were low, but holy shit. All right. Just as optimized and flawless as original arc. They've somehow made it even less optimized and even more flawed. Like. Bet they can get some real good screenshots if they very carefully point the camera in the right direction. Yes, please, bird. End my life. Do it. Okay. Let's respawn somewhere else. I feel like my mouse sensitivity changed. I want to point out, by the way, chat, that the start to all this was me getting 24 frames per second in the character creator before the map was even loaded.
We're about to die again. I'm just running around. This is getting decent frames. I'm sure he is. I'm sure Fist has a much better computer than mine. What the fuck is going on with the fucking lighting in here? Get eaten by a raptor, why not? Oh good, they made Dino AI smarter, so now it can path around and kill you when you jump on top of rocks. Yeah, I know half the reason that I'm having such issue is that I'm running a 2080 Ti because I haven't felt like spending $4,000 on a... I'm floating on top of this rock, by the way. I haven't felt like spending $4,000 on a new video card. But that 2080 Ti has been flawless in every other game I've played. I still play almost every single game on full max settings and get over 60 frames per second. Often all the way up to 144. This game just runs like shit. Imagine Atlas with Unreal 5 Engine. I mean, if it's anything like Ark with Unreal 5 Engine, I'd rather not. This is a remaster of the original Ark. Much in the same way that Warcraft 3 was a remaster of... Warcraft 3 Reforged was a remaster of Warcraft 3. Which is to say, they removed most of the features, deleted the original, and... The game is shit. The water looks like trash. What are you talking about? The water looks like a fucking Twitch stream. Do you see all that art? Here, let me clarify. Maybe, maybe you're looking at the water and saying, oh, it only looks like that because I'm watching it on Twitch. It doesn't. It looks like that on my screen, too. <laughs> Is it really running that bad? I am on low settings. Not the lowest possible, but the lowest possible settings look like a horrific fucking, like, LSD trip. And I'm getting 40 frames per second right now. If I look out over the water at nothing, first person, 41 frames per second. And yeah, the clouds are fucking on some shit. Like, the whole point 
of them upgrading to Unreal Engine 5 was because they were like, we'll be able to make it look better and have better performance. So far, they have succeeded at neither of those goals. It looks, in my opinion, worse because the shit that's trying to make it look nicer isn't working properly. So you end up with trees that look like they're made out of fucking... Like, I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's like lines of pixels that I can see in the trees. The clouds are doing whatever the fuck that is. The water looks like a Twitch stream. I'll tell you... This... Here's what it is, chat. This feels like it should have been a free upgrade to the original arc. Which was what they were originally going to do before they decided instead that they were going to charge full price for it. Fuck, this could have been a $10 upgrade to the original arc. And I would have been like, yeah, you know what? If you're someone that's got a crazy, ridiculous PC, go for it. Oh, can we make it rain all the time? The game looks better when it's raining. I don't know, chat. The... This has put me in a bit of a fucking mood to the point where I don't, I don't know how much effort, how much more effort I really want to put into this. I was already not very excited for it. I started seeing people posting screenshots and I was like, oh, maybe it'll actually be good. And then as soon as I launch the game, it's just been fucking downhill. You just got it to settings you like. This is the closest I've gotten it. I wish I could figure out what the fuck was going on with the cloud. If, if we can get the clouds to stop fucking off. Without. What if we set to medium textures? Clouds are still fucking off and I lost six frames. Textures back to low. Post-processing to medium. Clouds got worse. See, why can't I turn post-processing off? If I turn down the, I'll, I'll turn down the shadows. I'll show you what happens if I turn down the shadows. You're going to love this. First, first step is fucking nothing. Literally, I turned down shadows and nothing happened at all. Like, that's actually surprising. Fucking nothing happened. Like, literally fucking nothing. Does that setting even do anything? Literally nothing. No difference. But here we go. Global illumination quality. We go from high to medium. What the fuck is that? I don't think you have to restart after every change. But yeah, like...
Okay, I really need to figure out what setting is making the clouds go on a fucking... I bet it's this. What if I set this to balance? I'm going to lose a ton of frames. No, nope, it's still doing it. Oh, no, it's not. Or only in certain spots. Maybe only at the edges of the clouds, which we don't have now because let's let's turn this back to performance. It does seem like it's related to that. But if I turn super resolution off, by the way, um, A, now it's doing it again. And B, my frame rate starts to tank. What the fuck? Okay, I'm now, I'm now starting to think it wasn't that. It's something else. Let's put it back on balanced. This was where I had it, and that wasn't happening as much. Wow, the clouds look like shit even when they're not supposed to look like shit. What the fuck? Like, look at how they're, like, rolling. That looks horrible. Can I turn off clouds? Set that to quality, see what happens. All right, I'm gonna put this back where it was. What about NVIDIA Reflex? Oh God. Yeah, oh cool, there was a big black square in the upper left of my screen for a second. I'm hoping there's just a patch that comes out that's like... ...fixed all the shitty graphical bugs that shouldn't have been in there in the fucking first place. Like, notice, I don't know if you guys can see it very clearly. Notice how my hair is like all patchy and spotty and weird. If I, like, zoom the camera in real close, then it looks correct. But there's, like, this weird green fucking tinge to it. Oh, here we go. Let's toggle photo mode. Yeah, what a picturesque photo. Now it looks like a Twitch stream again.
Yeah, let's try let's try a game restart. Seems like if I look directly at the clouds and then away, then they start to not look as shitty. I'm still only getting 39 frames per second. What if we do foliage quality medium? Why are they like chat? You see this? It's like snapping in and out of view around me. You don't see it in first person. It's because it's trying to render the ones that are next to me. But that means if you. <laughs> if you're in third person and you run along with foliage quality set to low, that they just disappear behind you as you run. Let's set it all the way to low, see what happens. I gained no frames from that, by the way. Oh my god. What the fuck? <laughs> All right. Thirty six frames per second with foliage on low. Thirty seven frames per second with foliage on Epic. So that makes no difference at all. Might as well leave the foliage on. Look at how the foliage is on Epic and it's still fucking snapping and popping around me though as I run. I have foliage maxed and as I run towards things they snap around. Chat, was this game developed by an AI? Did Chat GPT make this? Did fucking... Did they just shove the original source code for Ark Survival Ascended into stable... Or Ark Survival Evolved into stable diffusion? And this is what they got? Render distance is set to low. But foliage quality is set to max. Let's see if this still happens if I set render distance to max. I have a 2080 Ti. Which is still, for the record, still one of the top rated video cards on the market. 
let's find render distance. This is going to tank my frame rate. But view distance, we'll set it to high. It made the... It made me have to take two more steps before I see the... shit popping in and out. We'll run the other way for a second. Yeah, I can still see them fucking popping around all over the place. With view distance set to high. But like the fucking floating, it's easier it's easier for me to point it out with the view distance set to low so you know what I'm looking at. So here we put um, view distance back to low. You see the like extra plants that are floating in the air in front of me? If I set view distance to epic, as high as it goes. you still see them. You get another two steps away before you see them. But you still see them. I leave view distance on low. Why can I not adjust anti-aliasing? Let's turn that off. Turn off foliage and fluid interaction. You know what? It's actually much less noticeable now. Like there's still that shit floating in air. The grass isn't moving at all anymore, but it's also not snapping around me weirdly. And also I gained like three frames per second. Like I'm not seeing it as much at least. Those ones still are. But I'm not seeing it as much popping in and changing around in front of me as I run. Yeah, let's try turning the foliage quality quality. We'll go all the way to low. Like genuinely, I would prefer this anyway. Like they look like shit, but okay, now it's gonna snap around all over the place still. Like what the fuck? If it was consistent, I wouldn't be as upset. Like if it was, I don't see any foliage down on that beach at all, but as I get close to it, it, it appears. That'd be one thing. But like some of it is fucking disappearing as I get closer to it. All oh, the clouds are on there, shit again. Also, uh, I don't think I gained any frame rate from that. In fact, I did not. It It's starting to seem like there are very little of these settings actually affect my frame rate. Yeah, same, same frame rate on Epic for foliage quality. In 1080p, yeah, I did that and there was no difference. I'll do it again real quick. So um, we'll go, we'll go back into, we'll go full screen. We'll leave it at 20, uh, we'll leave it at 2K for now. We'll go full screen. My 
capture card is gonna have to figure out its shit real quick. There we go. Full screen mode. I actually picked up about two frames per second. We're at 41 frames per second now. 42 even. Um, is there actually a... Oh, that's a tiny little thing over on the right. Oh my god. Fuck. <laughs> Pteranodon's just trying to fucking... Okay, that was not what I wanted. I was trying to see if this would give a better... Um, FPS counter. But you can't really see it. Yeah. That's like harder to read than the fucking steam one way up in the upper right corner. Um, okay. So let's try. We were at 42 frames per second. Let's try dropping it to 1080p. Capture card needs to reconfigure. Let's see if my capture card even finds it at all. All right. My Capture card really hates that. Really hates that. Um So here I'll, I'll just I'll just explain what I'm seeing and hopefully if I set it back then it's better. Um I now have 40, about 50 frames per second, but everything looks like a blurry, shitty mess. So that, that is not an option for me. There we go. Yeah, I gained about eight frames per second going to 1080p, but it was a blurry, shitty mess. General Shadow is still on max. That setting appears to do nothing. Like, literally nothing. Like, here. Observe. Current. I have 41 frames per second. General Shadow is to low. It looks identical. I did pick up a couple frames per second. I didn't pick up any frames per second when I did that last time. So maybe general shadows on low is another small frame rate save I could do. Looking at grass this whole nine and a half hours. No, 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 no. We played Moria for a while and then we played um, Ghost Runner and finished Ghost Runner. Yeah, the clouds, the clouds just seem to look like shit. And I don't, I don't know that there's a setting to solve that because I haven't been able to get them to not look like shit even when I put everything on Ultra. Mitza back for eight months. Not so optimized in the early access will give them cover for some time to come. Oh yeah, has that worked so well for Ark Survival Evolve?
Yeah, maybe the... I know Cherry said that the quality of life stuff has been improved. Maybe the game will be better enough that I will not notice how dog shit it looks. Oh, you guys want to see my favorite setting? This is the acid trip setting. You turn global illumination quality to anything other than high. You can just go to medium. Acid trip. Also, what the fuck is still going on with my hair? It did save me some frame rate. Let's actually go into the... Into the acid trip over here and see if it looks any different. Oh god, no, it's getting worse as I get closer. Holy shit. Like, my character looks mostly okay, except for the weird shit going on with his hair. I'm floating above the rock, chat. Oh yeah, there's definitely screen tearing. It looks like less of an acid trip if you have it on high. I'm still only getting about 45 frames per second, but that I can I can tolerate 45 frames per second if I'm enjoying the game. The clouds are having their own little acid trip pretty much constantly. Graphics look good. I disagree. There's a lot of shit that they did that it's like Let's make the colors more vibrant and let's make the fucking something or other happen. And it, they just not, aren't pulling it off well to where it all kind of looks a bit shit. Hundred FPS with fake frames enabled. What is fake frames? God, the water looks like dog shit. I cannot get over how bad that looks. Again, on the Twitch stream, on the Twitch stream, you might be looking at that and saying, oh, that's just the stream artifacting. The water probably looks great. Oh, he has a 4090, of course, then. The, the, the water doesn't look great. This is fucking... This is what the water looks like. In fact, hold on. I'm going to actually maximize my my own stream real quick so I can see what it looks like through the stream.
It actually looks better through my Twitch stream than it does because what you're not seeing on the Twitch stream is the pixelation that's in the middle of it also. Like, hold on, let me see if I can. Oh God, I forgot I can't do that. Oh, maybe I can. Okay. I assume that the trailer, they did it on like some machine that had like dual 4090s or something in it. Like some just godly machine. But they were like, let's do, let's pump it up in the best it can possibly look. And they just, like, no one can do that. And touched up, yeah. SLI is disabled in new RTX GPUs. Okay. Then whatever the top of the line fucking shit they could get is. Uh, let me see. This is doing some weird shit. Oh, here's what I'm going to do, actually. We're going to go back into windowed full screen because it doesn't need exclusive mode. Don't think the trailer was real gameplay. I would also assume it was not real gameplay. I need to understand what the fuck is going on with my hair. Like, I've not been able to find a setting that doesn't make my hair all patchy and weird. What the fuck is advanced graphics? The clouds are now having an acid trip even when I look directly at them. I don't know what advanced graphics is, but it didn't affect my frame rate at all, and now the clouds look weird. It didn't fix my hair either. Yeah, that setting also appears to do nothing. Going back to my little rock. Oh my god. This water looks like trash. Fucking Oblivion had better water than this. Like, here's here's what this looks like to me, chat. This looks like Studio Wildcard got their hands on UE5. And they were like, yeah, let's let's turn everything on. Let's do all the cool stuff in UE5. And they did all of it poorly. Like. Like if someone got like a master painter's paint supplies. Got into a master painter's paint supplies and just tried to use everything. Oh my god, it looks like shit. It does look better with DLSS on. Especially the water looks better with DLSS on. Oh, 
but I'm only getting 34 frames per second now. My frame rate is definitely getting worse the darker it gets. Also, do you see the fucking like blinking shit over on the right side of the screen? What the fuck is that? Yeah, that the edge of view, it seems like it. So it seems like they're trying to prioritize rendering in the center of the screen, which is fine, but they're letting weird shit happen at the edges of the screen as a result. I don't think that did anything. Because I'm in windowed full screen. I'm excited for it to become dark and see if they've made it so you don't have to change your fucking gamma settings every time it gets dark in this game yet. Let's go punch a tree and start trying to actually play the game. That's a compi over there. Oh, Ark. And your insistence on players being able to instantly die the moment they start playing the video game. Okay. I need to fix a key bind.
I am getting much better frame rate at night. Let's level up a bit. Yeah, I'm sure for people who love Ark, this is probably great. Um, I don't love Ark. I have whatever the opposite of nostalgia is for Ark. And like literally the the first hour, hour and a half of my gameplay so far has been trying to make the game fucking playable. Yeah, Atlas is a spinoff of the Ark engine. I don't like Atlas either, for the record. I play it because of the RP in it. And because I like the ship building. But the majority of that game is trash. And also runs like shit. That has nothing to do with the genre. I've played a billion survival crafting games, and I usually love survival crafting games. I just think Ark is shit. I do appreciate that they've now put a billion tiny rocks on the beaches so that you can't tell which ones you can pick up. Okay, let's compare Ark to Conan Exiles. Conan Exiles has enjoyable combat. Ark does not. Conan Exiles has good frame rate and playable uh, performance. Ark does not. Conan Exiles has interesting skill trees and excellent cosmetic options. Ark does not. Like you're if your if your argument is doesn't like Ark, therefore must not like any survival crafting games, then you are incorrect.
I'm running around mashing E trying to find a single fucking stone so I can make a pick. And because these awesome new graphics have put a million tiny stones on the beaches, I literally can't find a single fucking rock. Oh, yeah, that's another thing for me about Ark. I fucking hate dino taming and breeding. Like, that, there has never been a less interesting game system to me than dino taming and breeding. And that's the majority of what Ark is, so... Yeah, none of these rocks are rocks I can pick up, apparently. I'm literally running around mashing E. Yeah, seven, day, seven Days to Die is another really good one. That was just a... I, when Crystal Isles came out for the original arc, I spent a lot of time taming and breeding the crystal dragons. Because I was like, maybe if I do a lot of it, I'll like it. I didn't. Also, I spent the first, like, six hours of this stream playing Return to Moria and loving it. literally can't pick up any of these rocks. Oh good, it's one of those fucking birds. Like, how the fuck... Do I have to punch a rock? No. I still have no stone. Literally cannot find a single stone that can be picked up because there's a billion fake rocks on the fucking... So it's possible I've run past them. I've, I've been spamming E for the past 15 minutes. I've not stopped pressing E this whole time. And because there's a fucking billion tiny rocks on the beach now because oh my god amazing new graphics i can't find a single fucking actually pick up a bull rock I can drink the water. Let's go over there. Like, how are none of these rocks ones that can be picked up? Finally, we found a rock. I don't know what about those rocks was different than the others. The 
the medium size racks. There's been no difference in rock size. And some of them I just was able to pick up for reasons. There, it's the slightly orange ones. There we go. Those are the rocks we can pick up, are the slightly orange ones. Not any of these other bajillion rocks that are around. It's those that we can pick up. Now we need some flint. You can turn down ground clutter, but then it makes it pop in and out all over the place. I had that shit turned off. Camera view bob is off. Camera shake scale is at zero. It's like we gather in in third person because I can't deal with this fucking constant shaking. There, I've solved my annoying hair problem. Let's make a... Holy shit, I have 55 frames per second right now. Let me find some shit to kill for hide. Why did my frame rate tank as soon as I pulled out a fucking spear? Okay, maybe it wasn't because of the spear. Took a shit.
That's a bad idea. I don't remember if you get to hide from dead ends. Looks like you do. Fucking camera shake in first person. Is there really no setting for that? I like camera off animation. There we go. Turn that off. Why that's not under camera, I do not understand. There we go. That's better. Thank fuck. Make ourselves a little house. PC gonna be crossplay with consoles? I have no idea. The snapping is interesting.
Okay, video game. Cool. So apparently, chat, when playing ARC shit-ass, which is what the SA stands for, in single-player mode, if you crash, you lose everything since the last time you relogged. In, in this game, with nothing that approximates a save game function. Maybe not since I relogged. Maybe this was only 
an hour ago. Because I came over and punched this tree. And then I spent half an hour running around on the beach trying to find a single fucking rock. Holy shit, I am so far. From where I was. Let's see if we can use our new mind knowledge to find a rock that I can pick up. Or, you know, get eaten by that guy. Okay. Did find rocks that I could pick up. So I need to make this fiber. I need Goose with the raid. What's up, everybody? I'm currently attempting to tolerate this video game, and it is not making that easy. Hope y'all had a good time on Goose's stream. Hope you had a good time. That's about how it's going. To answer your question. You gonna fucking come at me, bro? You're just gonna stare at me. I fully expected these to be trying to kill me.
I'm slowly getting used to the dumb graphical glitches. The game definitely looks way better at night than it does during the day. Kind of like me with the lights off. I look way better that way. <laughs> oh, hello, beaver. Fuck it. I'm going for it. Suck my dick, Velophosaur. Oh, you want some too? Everybody wants some. somewhere. Alright, well I can't find the other one that I killed. Your Atlas crew might be done. Why is that? Just like did everything you've wanted to over it now. Moving on to other stuff. Yeah. I feel like we're starting to get to that point. Our crew will probably hang on to the bitter end in Atlas, but we're definitely at the point where people are more and more like, oh, it's a baby. Look at the little baby Dilophosaur. Isn't it cute? Fucking kill it. And adopt them when they don't have a parent. Well, I'd rather have all this raw prime meat that I get for killing children. I briefly thought about trying to adopt it, but then decided that actually, fuck it. What the fuck do I need a Dilophosaur for? Meat hasn't tasted sadness yet. I don't know if that's true. I did kill its parents in front of it.
Yeah, that's right, Beaver Man. Piranhas. Well, I robbed the beaver, but he doesn't care because he's not here. God, there's a lot of wood in there. Alright, I'm officially so far overweight that I can't do anything. Can I craft some shit? No, because I don't have thatch. Alright. Well then, I guess, fuck all this wood. Build a little spot up here. <clears throat> That's an animation. Has the game received day one patch that magically fixed performance problems? I'm surprised your gameplay is so smooth when people with RTX 4090 struggle. Uh, I have been fighting with the fucking graphic settings for like three hours. I basically only just started playing. But I, I switched to this um, four hours ago. Three hours ago. Oh, good. Why not an alpha raptor? Why not an alpha raptor? Wait, did it get bored and wander off? Big if true. If staying away from shit like that long enough that they lose interest and wander off is a thing. That would be some welcome fucking news.
Don't worry though, chat. Building pieces are still somehow heavier than the materials used to make them. Walls and door frames are the same piece. That's good. The fuck is that supposed to look like? gonna go grab that drop that it poofed before I got to it. Fuck off. Oh, good. Could you fuck off? See, before it got bored and wandered off. Now it wants my ass.
Oh, good. Oh, sun's coming up. Here comes the fucking bizarre lighting problems again. Don't you love that chat? Good, you're still fucking here. How the fuck? How do I even get back up there? How did I get up there before? Alright, well, I'm pretty sure one of my deaths was over here somewhere, but that shit's all gone. Oh, is that it? Hey, look at that. Alright, I don't make a fucking bed. I need more thatch and hide. Oh. 
Yeah, as soon as the sun comes out, my frame rate goes to shit. There's something wrong with the way it does sunlight. There's something wrong with the way it does a lot of things. We're getting the fucking weird ass clouds again, too. Like, I'm getting barely 30 frames per second, usually less now. And the only difference is that the sun came up. Like, that is a painful frame, frame rate difference. When I say painful, I mean literally painful. This hurts. The water looks so fucking weird. Yeah, I don't know, chat. I don't, I'm not thinking this is the game for me. If you big love Ark and want to play a version of Ark that looks better in some ways and worse than others, and doesn't have mods. And runs like shit. But you're okay with playing the game at 15 frames per second if it looks better. Then maybe... Maybe you will enjoy this, but... This is worse than 10 other survival crafting games that came out this year. This is worse than the early access for the front. This is worse than Moria. Oh, this is way worse than Moria. I would play Moria over this every single day of the week.
I'll tell you one thing. Um, it's definitely made me want to play more Atlas. Not liking Ark. I've barely played Ark because I've spent the entire time trying to get my frame rate to not be fucking garbage. Like, I've had it running. I, I've been in game for three hours at least. Three, three and a half hours now. And probably two and a half hours of that was trying to get my frame rate to not be fucking garbage. And I finally had it at a playable state where I was getting about 45 frames per second, which isn't good, but is enough that I can play it without fucking hating myself. And then the sun came up and for some fucking reason, whatever they did with sunlight in this game dropped my frame rate by literally 20. So I now have maybe 30 frames per second, usually below 30. I've got 28 right now. And it's just like, it actually fucking hurts me to look at. Like my eyes cannot handle it. It is giving me eye strain. So I think I'm done. I think that's all the arc for me. I'm not going to subject myself to a game that is not fun. Uh, literally has nothing going for it over another 50 survival crafting games that are available on the market. Uh, looks like shit and runs worse. No fucking reason for me to spend any more time on this. So, I think we're going to call it good. Well, we're not going to call it good. We're going to call it shit. I think we're going to call it shit and not play it again. I'm glad that I got the key for free because if I had spent money on this garbage, I would be fucking furious. Like, this literally feels like they got their hands on the UE5 dev kit. They started poking around the engine. They went, look at all the cool stuff that UE5 can do. And didn't know how to optimize fucking any of it. So instead of what everyone had hoped UE5 arc was going to be, which was arc that maybe looks a bit better, but runs way smoother. Instead, we got arc that somehow looks worse and runs worse. So I'm, I'm fucking over it. We're done. I'm going to call the stream there chat before I just start fucking ranting like crazy. Cause this shit has pissed me off. I will uh, be back around tomorrow. We'll probably play a video, a video game that isn't complete dog shit. Um, yeah, maybe, maybe we'll play a game that I, that doesn't make me hate myself tomorrow. That's a good idea, but I'm out of here. Thanks everybody for hanging out. Sorry this game was dog shit. I'll see you next time. Peace.